Welcome to the fantasy audiobook. Konoha. I, Naruto, don't follow the rules. Chapter 1. Hatch. A young figure sneezed, sat up from the bed, and pulled the thin quilt covering his body, wanting to wrap it tighter and give himself more warmth. It's a pity that the comforter is of limited use in the early morning chill. What is this called? This childhood is too difficult. If you wear it directly as Naruto who is about to graduate, you won't have to endure these beggar-like lives. I can't eat enough, I don't wear warm clothes, and I have to endure other people's eyes, it's just too much. Wrapped in a quilt, Naruto got up slowly and walked towards the kitchen, intending to light a fire and boil water to keep warm. Sleep must not continue to sleep. If it weren't for Naruto's excellent bloodline and good health since he was a child, he might have been reincarnated early due to many disasters and illnesses. Five-year-old Naruto, like an adult, sighed melancholy. But the actual situation is that there is indeed a soul in his twenties in this five-year-old young body. Chen Yang didn't know why he was transmigrated into a two-dimensional animation, but he only knew that his start was not ideal. Although the future is bright, Naruto can gain great strength as usual in the future as long as he follows the steps. However, for his predecessor who lived a good life since he was a child, he couldn't bear all these hardships. Not to mention that Naruto is only five years old at this time, even if he is older, if he wants to earn some money through labor, someone must be willing to recruit him. And Naruto's reputation is the worst among Konoha. It's so bad that as long as anyone mentions it, they will dislike it and avoid it like the plague. This hit Naruto very hard. It's only been three days since I've been here, and I've already seen the warmth and coldness of the world, and the coldness of human feelings. Because of this, Naruto didn't even want to go out. And also the food that was saved before. After eating the instant noodles, Naruto has been hungry for a day. If I don't go out to find something to eat, I don't know when I will starve to death. Although according to his guess, 3rd Hokage Sarutobi Hiruzen would definitely help him and prevent him from dying, but he probably won't show up until the last step. This bad day is really enough. Sitting by the stove, warmed by the flames, Naruto cursed and wondered where to find something to fill his stomach today. And this month's living expenses of 1,000 tails were all spent before he crossed over. There are still a few days before the money will be issued next month, and Naruto will have to rely on his own efforts for the gap in the middle. That old man from third generation, his grandson is well clothed and lives in a luxurious mansion, while my son of a hero lives in a shabby rental house, and his life is so miserable, won't his conscience hurt? This hypocrisy is worse than Danzo. Snort, Naruto stared at the flames, feeling his body slowly warming up, he couldn't help being dazed. After all, no matter how much you complain about the existing miserable situation, you can't change the reality. Just when Naruto was in a daze, a voice suddenly sounded in his mind. The anti-routine system is successfully bound. Successful anti-routine, you can get rewards randomly. Quote question mark quote. What the hell? Cheat. Naruto's reaction was a beat late, and then he was pleasantly surprised. With cheat, don't you have to starve and suffer from cold? Naruto may have been devastated by the life of the past few days, and his first reaction was not to gain great strength, but simple food and clothing. What do you mean by anti-routine? Playing cards not according to common sense, not obeying other people's arrangements, and going against other people's wishes are all counter-routines. What about rewards? What can I get? Including but not limited to chakra, ninjutsu, taijutsu, illusion, physique, props, etc. Ah, don't you play cards according to common sense? Naruto thought carefully. If you look at it this way, as long as you succeed in countering the routine, although you can't solve your urgent needs immediately, you can change your situation through the various rewards you get. It would be great if I could get an item that wouldn't be hungry without eating. Naruto smacked his mouth thinking. In this case, let's try it first. Naruto immediately turned off the fire, ignored the hot water that was about to boil, pulled the quilt off his body, and ran out the door. His actions stunned Anbu, who was watching from the tree outside the house. What's the matter? Have a stomachache. Isn't there a bathroom in the room? Although he was puzzled, he still did not forget his mission, and kept his eyes on the target to see what he was going to do. On Konoha Street in the morning, many shops have already opened for business early. 
Various breakfasts and small restaurants also welcomed many villagers who got up early and were busy. There are even quite a few ninjas wearing forehead protectors. Naruto walked on the street, thinking about the operating principle of his own cheat, to see how it is an anti-routine. Naruto looked around while walking, looking for opportunities. Fortunately, there were not many people at this time, and Naruto was not allowed to enjoy the attention ceremony. Until Naruto came to a stall selling breakfast. What are you looking at? Get lost. The vendor owner looked disgusted and angry in front of two or three villagers who were buying breakfast, and yelled loudly at Naruto who hadn't approached and just stopped walking for less than two seconds. And the people who bought breakfast were not surprised, even put on the same expression, and then quickly paid and left, as if staying here for a long time would be unlucky. Naruto was about to ignore them and continue walking, but stopped again. Playing cards not according to common sense, not obeying other people's arrangements, and going against other people's wishes are all anti-routines. Naruto remembered Cheat's introduction and muttered to himself. In this way, if you put it into the boss's psychology, he hates me very much now and wants to disappear from his eyes. If it is counter-routine. Thinking of this, Naruto turned around and walked in front of the vendor. What are you still doing here? Don't you understand human language? Tell you to get out. Seeing that the incarnation of the demon fox didn't leave immediately, the boss even came over, the anger in his heart rose sharply, and he cursed at Naruto even more mercilessly. Well, come and share early. In order to succeed in the experiment, Naruto endured insults and said to the boss. Quote exclamation mark quote, quote question mark quote. The boss's tone froze, and he looked at Naruto as if he had seen a ghost. No, where did he get the courage to ask himself for breakfast? Don't you know that you hate him? Didn't I scold him just now? Didn't you hear me? The anti-routine is successful, and a hot pot is obtained, which has been stored in the backpack. Hot pot. This is a success. It turns out that anti-routine is such a usage. Naruto was very happy to see that his experiment was successful. In particular, he also got a delicious food that is hard to eat in this world, which made Naruto more confident about this cheat. Eat and dress warmly, right now. Want to eat breakfast? Dream. Get out of here quickly, don't delay my business. It's disgusting to see you. The boss yelled again at Naruto who seemed to be deaf. It doesn't matter whether he heard it or not, anyway, let's talk about it after scolding. Besides, who in Konoha would sell things to the demon fox? Want to eat my stuff, dream it. You mean, no more. Naruto looked at the boss. Get lost. If you don't leave, I'll beat you up. The boss couldn't bear it anymore. If you don't give it, then I won't leave. It is estimated that others will not come to buy your breakfast when they see me standing here. Anyway, it's your business that's being delayed. Naruto crossed his arms and looked indifferent. You. As soon as the boss picked up the spatula next to him, he was about to come out and prepare to do something. Anyway, it's a demon fox that people hate, so it's okay to beat him up, as long as he doesn't kill him, even Lord Third Hokage won't hold him accountable. You have to do it. Naruto rolled his eyes, feeling a little flustered. After all, it was me who was beaten and hurt. However, he remembered that before he came here, Naruto seemed to have been beaten, so Sarutobi here is an issued an order to ask Konoha's shop owners not to sell anything to Naruto. Did he remember wrongly? What's wrong with me? The boss glared at me, you still dare to control me. Seeing that he was serious, Naruto's thoughts changed sharply. Suddenly, when the boss was only two steps away from him and raised his hands, Naruto let out an exclamation and fell back immediately. Oh, it hurts. The anti-routine is successful, and you can get five recovery pills. After taking it, you can quickly recover from the injury. Quote dot 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 quote. The boss stopped his movements abruptly, looking at Naruto who fell on the ground and howled, with a dazed look on his face. What's the situation? Haven't hit him yet. Why did you suddenly fall down? Could it be? Pinky. The boss is so angry. The nasty kid actually dared to touch porcelain. He couldn't bear it. He wants to beat someone. Just when he was about to step forward to kick Naruto, a figure appeared in front of the boss with a bang, blocking him. Forget it. Zongu appeared helplessly. Although the kid's acting skills were clumsy, it was true that the boss wanted to do something. In addition to monitoring Uzumaki Naruto, 
Anbu also has to protect his safety. Since Naruto was beaten by others last time, Hokage ordered that whenever this happens again, the Anbu must take action in time. After all, the villagers, dislike for Naruto was real. If someone really didn't hold back his hands and used too much strength, Naruto, who was only five years old, would not be able to bear it. Even with Chakra who has nine tails and the bonus of Vortex Physique, it is still very dangerous to be seriously injured. In particular, they can't guarantee whether this will affect the seal. Secretly Anbu, the boss's heart tightened. Ahem, since your lord said so, forget it. Although the boss dared to do it, he didn't dare to do it in front of Anbu. After all, Anbu is directly under Hokage and represents Lord Hokage. A small villager like him dare not disobey their orders. Isn't it over if this is the case? What about my breakfast? If I don't give it, I won't leave. Seeing Anbu appear, Naruto immediately breathed a sigh of relief, luckily he guessed right. Then he got up immediately, patted the dust on his body, and said to the boss again. You, seeing Anbu who hadn't left yet, the boss swallowed his anger, took a few steamed buns, packed them in a bag and handed them to Naruto. Today is his bad luck. Naruto took the bag, smiled and turned to leave. Zongu twitched the corner of his mouth and disappeared quickly. I was very puzzled. What's going on today? Why is this kid so uncharacteristic? Isn't he usually indifferent to being beaten and scolded? Why did you have the courage to go up against others today? Nakatani silently recorded Naruto's situation in the mission report. Dot dot dot. Tisk. Although it's a bit uncomfortable and embarrassing, it seems that this harvest is not bad. As long as you reverse the routine, you can get rewards. Generally speaking, I made money. And with Anbu's protection, as long as Nine Tails doesn't run amok, it seems that I can actually walk sideways in Konoha. Naruto found Wadian and continued to wander while eating steamed buns. When there were more and more people, Naruto subconsciously wanted to go home and stay away from these stupid villagers. But when he thought that he would still be rewarded, he stopped. Naruto took a deep breath and looked for the target again. This wool. No, this reward, he wants to order it. Dot dot dot. After a while, Naruto used the same method again and got some fruits. And a new reward. The anti-routine is successful, and a fruit platter has been obtained, which has been stored in the backpack. What's more, Naruto discovered that these villagers are indeed a fool. First, they swear at each other, and then drive Naruto away. If they don't leave, they will do it. Nakatani once again admired Naruto's acting skills with a blank face, and came out to support the stage, for Naruto as usual. Then Naruto got what he wanted. Nakatani felt Naruto's abnormality more and more. Is it because there is no money and food, so now you are giving up on yourself? Nakatani blamed Naruto's situation on excessive hunger that made him desperate. Otherwise, the previous Naruto would not have done these things. Just when Zongu thought that Naruto had enough to eat and drink, it was time to end, but unexpectedly, Naruto was still continuing his wool sweeping operation. In one morning, Naruto went from the breakfast shop at the beginning to fruit shops, clothes shops, department stores, dot all went shopping once. Until noon, when I walked out of a restaurant, I was still carrying a big bag in my hand, as if I had finished shopping. Hey, you haven't paid yet. It's 300 tails in total. As soon as Naruto went out, the owner of the restaurant chased him out. Ah, I have no money. Naruto's confident Kaido. Quote exclamation mark exclamation mark quote. What do you eat if you don't have money? The boss exploded in an instant. He made an exception to let you come in for dinner today which already made him very uncomfortable, and he also lost a group of customers. As a result, you patted your ass and left after eating, looking like you were eating a king's meal. Who are you bullying? Don't think that just because you are a demon fox, you can eat without paying. Even if Master Hokage is here, he still has to eat and pay the bill. But, I really don't have any money. How about you beat me up? Naruto looked at the boss arrogantly, with a toothpick in his mouth, asking for money or his life. But do you dare to take it? Quote dot 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 quote. The boss looked at Naruto, his face turned red. Do you think I don't want to beat you up? If it weren't for Anbu to back you up, I would have beat you up when you first entered my restaurant. Just when the boss doesn't know what to do. 
Zongu appeared again, took out 300 tails from his wallet and handed it to the boss, while sighing deeply. What the hell, I followed this nasty brat today, just paying his bills and wiping his ass. Big loss. You must ask Mr. Hokage for reimbursement. Thank you, Ninja-sama, please go. Seeing that he had been compensated for his loss, the boss smiled at Zongu who was wearing a mask. Anyone can come to eat, but you have to pay. Of course, he doesn't care who pays. After eating and drinking, Naruto went home with his big and small bags. Zongu also breathed a sigh of relief. Finally home. If this continues, his wallet will be emptied. Why hasn't the shift time come yet? Dot dot dot. Naruto returned home and sorted out some clothes, quilts, food, used in other daily necessities that the foxes and tigers collected today. Then he walked into the bathroom with the newly bought clothes. Finally, I can take a good bath and change clothes. In the bathroom, Naruto was using the new shampoo and shower gel with a happy face. God knows how he got here before. There are basically no daily necessities, and there is no way to buy them. After all, 1,000 tails a month is enough for Naruto to eat, not to mention new clothes and daily necessities. A piece of broken soap is only a thin piece. This caused him to travel over here, and he hasn't taken a bath yet. This is simply unbearable for Naruto. Fortunately, he got a cheat today, which finally solved his life problems. Although, these things are not rewards obtained through cheating, but unexpected joys obtained during use. But in the process of using the anti-routine system, Naruto also knew that although he was hated by the entire Konoha village, he still had the so-called privilege. That is, he comes with a Jonin bodyguard. And orders from 3rd Hokage Serutobi Hirazan. As long as Naruto doesn't play tricks, it is possible to get some simple things from Konoha. Those store owners cannot do Naruto's business, but they can't refuse Anbu and Hokage. This allowed Naruto to squeeze the wool without any scruples. Even though those people looked dead to Naruto, they still had to offer things with both hands. After all, Naruto can scold, but can't hit. If something goes wrong, they will be taken away by Anbu. Therefore, no one wants to make this kind of mistake, so they can only endure it. As a result, Naruto walked around all morning and got a lot of things. At the same time, the villagers also found that this kid seemed a little different today. In the past, scolding him a few words would make him look very hurt. Even if you drive him away, you will bow your head and leave obediently. How can it be like today? It's useless to scold him, he can't be driven away, and he even wants to do his business by himself. Ignore him, and he will mock you in turn. It even affects your business in an above-board way. He wanted to make a move, but Anbu stopped him. It's just horrible. I'm so angry. Several bosses who suffered losses complained to each other and complained bitterly. It's really unlucky today, I was tricked by that kid. Who isn't? What a fool. But what can I do? Anbu's ninjas stand in front of him, and he can't fight them. Yeah, it seems that Lord Third Generation really broke his heart because of the demon fox. It's all like this, and he still has to protect him. After all, Master Third Generation is the strongest Hokage, and there is still some capacity for this, but it is hard for us. Why, did you lose a lot today? A certain boss suddenly asked. Ah, the loss is not the loss. Although he asked for a lot of things, Master Anbu paid for them all, but I felt uncomfortable, which made me not eat lunch, and I was so full of gas. Ha, huh, did you still charge the money? Otherwise, who would give him something for free? Although he is angry and disgusting, the business is still going on. What's the matter, you didn't ask for money? Ahem, I want it, I want it. A boss who sold breakfast turned red and then black. Asshole, I was so busy chasing him away that I forgot to ask for money. What a loss, dot dot dot. At the same time, there was an emotion in the hearts of these bosses, and their dislike of Naruto went up to a higher level again. And I hope that I won't meet him again tomorrow. Response. But Naruto didn't care about that. Anyway, his situation was like this, so how bad could it be? And, the angrier they are, the happier Naruto is. In the afternoon, Naruto didn't go out again. He was full of food and drink, and went to sleep comfortably with the newly acquired quilt. As for Zongu, he can finally switch shifts with others.
he has to report Naruto's abnormal situation today to Hokage-sama. Moreover, he also wanted to ask if he could ask for leave and find someone to replace him. Dot dot dot, Hokage building, Hokage office. What's wrong? Something happened to Naruto. Third Hokage Serutobi Hiruzen was smoking a cigarette, looking solemnly at Nakatani who came to report the task. Under normal circumstances, as long as there is no major problem with Naruto's situation on the day, it will be submitted in the form of a task report. And once the Anbu ninja came to report in person, something might have happened. However, if something happened, shouldn't he have reported it earlier? Why did you come here when the day was over? Then it shouldn't be a problem. Serutobi Hiruzen thought to himself. If I had known, I would have used the crystal ball to see what Naruto was doing today. Master Hokage, nothing happened to the target, it's just that, today's behavior is a bit abnormal. Nakatani knelt down on one knee and said seriously. Abnormal behavior, how abnormal? Serutobi Hiruzen frowned, very puzzled. Did something happen again? After several years of observation, Naruto has nothing else to do except that he is a bit out of character and likes to make trouble everywhere to attract attention. And even if you get into trouble, it's just a trivial matter. Anbu doesn't even need him, the Hokage, to figure it out. The situation is like this, after the target wakes up in the morning. Nakatani reported everything that Naruto did from morning to noon without missing a word. Quote dot 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 quote. Serutobi Hiruzen was a little confused after listening. Touch porcelain, bully, zero yuan purchase, eat overlord meal. Is this still the old Naruto? You say he is normal, Naruto has never done anything like this before. But if you want to say that he is abnormal, judging from Naruto's usual troubles, it seems reasonable again. It's just that the way of causing trouble has changed. Rather, it seemed as if he had noticed his hidden skills and began to use them recklessly. In Serutobi Hiruzen's view, this so-called, hidden skill, is the guarantee given to him by his own Hokage. After all, the safety of Nine Tails Jinchuriki is the concern of the entire Konoha executives. Therefore, as long as life safety is not involved, and the thinking is not crooked, then Naruto can indeed walk sideways in Konoha. Although Naruto does not have the status and treatment of a son of a hero, his protection is in line with the high standards of a son of a hero. Not even his grandson, Konohamaru. If Naruto knew that Serutobi Hiruzen had such an idea, he would probably laugh angrily. Whoever loves this treatment should take it. Has he run out of living expenses? Yes, it was used up a few days ago, and the instant noodles were also eaten up. Zongu felt a little uncomfortable. A child who is only a few years old and eats instant noodles every day will suffer from malnutrition sooner or later and will not grow taller. But he dared not show it. I see, you go to rest. Serutobi Hiruzen nodded, indicating that he already knew. He also understood Naruto's actions today, and like Nakatani, he thought that Naruto was fainted from hunger, so he made some unreasonable actions, which is also normal. At the same time, I was thinking in my heart that I should meet Naruto more often. After all, it's not easy to take the child with him when he's older, and he hasn't finished teaching the will of fire yet. Do you have anything else to do? Seeing that Nakatani had not left, Serutobi Hiruzen asked suspiciously. Hey, Mr. Hokage, today's expenses. Oh, this, you go to the financial office to register, and you will be reimbursed together with your salary next month. Yes, thank you Hokage-sama. After sleeping all afternoon, Naruto got up at night and took out the hot pot from his backpack. It can only be said that it is a product produced by the system. The hot pot has complete side dishes, both meat and vegetables, and the portions are full. At least Naruto can't finish it by himself. And he didn't bother to hide it, he just made a fake appearance, brought them out of the kitchen and put them on the table. Although this puzzled Anbu who was monitoring Naruto's every move outside, Nakatani gave him a copy of the written report when he was handing over the shift, which described in detail what strange things Naruto did today. Therefore, he thought that the ingredients that Naruto brought out might also be bought during the day. Naruto put the fat beef, potatoes, vegetables, etc. into the pot, waiting to be cooked, and at the same time counted the harvest this morning. One serving of hot pot. A fruit platter. One piece of invisibility cloak. A set of four on the bed. 
A pair of Jordan basketball shoes. One piece of cleansing technique. Buddha jumps over the wall a copy. Dot dot dot. Among these rewards, the best ones must be the invisibility cloak and the cleansing technique. Invisibility cloak. From Hogwarts, the famous series of magical novels. Moreover, this thing can also isolate chakra fluctuations and detection of perception, which can be described as an artifact. As if it belonged to the Hallows itself, even the Shinigami couldn't find anyone wearing the invisibility cloak. Naruto did not expect that he could get such a reward from the owner of the clothing store. It's just a waste of money. The second is cleaning. Cleansen, a small spell from Shushan novels. After use, it can quickly clean up the dirt on the body and clothes, which is very convenient. Moreover, in order to be equally applicable in the ninja world, it has been changed to be driven by chakra. It can only be said that the system only rewarded such a thing because it saw that he was too miserable and didn't even have anything to take a bath. This also let Naruto know the power of this cheat anti-routine system. Not only all kinds of ninjutsu, taijutsu, and illusion in the ninja world, but also things and props from other worlds and dimensions, as long as the time comes, there are only rewards you can't think of, without which you can't give. Oh, I don't have to live a hard life in the future. Naruto held a piece of fat beef between his hands, and tasted it contentedly. It's a pity that there is no Binkuo Luo, otherwise it would be even more enjoyable. Smell good. On the roof of Naruto. Yi Chuan sniffed the aroma of ingredients floating out of the window, couldn't help swallowing, and felt unbearably hungry for a moment. Where did you buy this thing? Why haven't I eaten it in Konoha? Go back and ask the location of the White Fox. White Fox is Zongu's code name. Anbu usually walks outside with a mask as his name, in order not to expose his identity. Except for Hitaki Kakashi. After all, the white hair and the signature Reikiri ninjutsu are almost unforgettable to those who have seen it. Not to mention the Sharingan. Just when he was distracted, suddenly, Naruto poked his head out of the window. What is he going to do? Yichuan looked at Naruto who was looking around strangely. As Anbu's brother here, quote exclamation mark quote, Yichuan's heart skipped a beat. What's the situation? How did Naruto find his place? I'm exposed. I have too much food here, so I can't finish it. Do you want to come out and eat some together? Naruto looked outside the window, regardless of whether he saw anyone or not, he just opened his mouth and yelled. It's just that outside, except for the bustling street below, it's still quiet. Naruto waited for a while, found no response, and went back. How does this brat know that Anbu is outside? Yi Chuan frowned, full of doubts. That's right, White Fox. Yi Chuan suddenly picked up the report and read it again. Sure enough, it's because the White Fox appeared too many times today, did it attract his attention? So, Anbu's monitoring of him has been exposed. Yi Chuan looked a little dignified. This is not good news. Exposure means information leakage. If Naruto is vigilant and guarded, then all his subsequent performances will be marked with a question mark. Does anyone know if he played it? It's just that a child who is only five years old has not received any education, so he shouldn't be so careful. Yichuan secretly recorded the information revealed by Anbu in the mission report. Let Hokage-sama handle these matters. Just keep looking at the target as usual. Just, a little hungry. If it wasn't for his status, he really wanted to go in and have dinner with Naruto. It smells so good. Successful anti-routine, get a copy of three-body technique. Hey, the routine is successful. Naruto sat back at the table with a satisfied smile and continued to enjoy the feast. He didn't expect that Anbu from outside would come in to have dinner with him, but there was a ready reward, don't let it go for nothing. As for what people will think, he is too lazy to care. Dot dot dot. Anbu has been exposed. Sure enough, from Anbu's appearance and intervention this morning, Naruto knew that someone was watching him, so was he so unscrupulous in the follow-up. This little guy is quite smart. Third Hokage Serutobi Hiruzen stood at Naruto's door and muttered to himself. He arrived just now, and was about to knock on the door, but he didn't expect Naruto to come with such a voice suddenly. But it also made him reevaluate Naruto. This child, as he grows older, has slowly begun to learn to think. It seems that I came here right, if I don't have much contact with Naruto now, the child will be at a loss if he grows crooked. Boom, 
Who is it? Naruto yelled towards the door. Who will come at this hour? I have no friends. It's me, Naruto, your third generation grandpa. Third generation. Surprised, Naruto got up quickly and ran to open the door. Although, he didn't want to meet Sarutobi Hiruzen. One is that I am afraid that I will be exposed as a counterfeit. After all, Sarutobi Hiruzen is an old man with a very vicious vision. The second is that it is very troublesome to deal with this old man. There is a set of routines. Grandpa third generation, Naruto opened the door and shouted with a smile. No way, who told the predecessor to trust Sarutobi Hiruzen incomparably? Naruto, I haven't seen you for a long time, how are you doing? Sarutobi Hiruzen looked at Naruto kindly. Fine. Ha, huh, it smells so good. Are you having dinner? I haven't eaten either. Can I join you? Sarutobi was also attracted by the aroma of hot pot. Besides, he really didn't eat. Okay, I just can't finish eating. Naruto led the way to the table. It's very rich. How did you get these? Even Sarutobi, who had eaten a big meal, couldn't help being shocked when he saw the table full of side dishes and the unique hot pot. Konoha has something like this. I do not know how. Who gave it to Naruto? Ah, I bought this ingredient today, as well as the pot, and then I thought it would be too troublesome to cook by myself, so I came up with this idea, as long as the water boils, put the vegetables in and cook them, and then you can eat them. Quote. Grandpa third generation, would you like to try? Oh, did you make it yourself? This idea is really novel. Seeing this, Sarutobi Hiruzen put aside his doubts for the time being, and planned to investigate after returning home. He picked up the chopsticks and tried it. Well, it really smells delicious. It was delicious. Seeing that Sarutobi Hiruzen was eating deliciously, Naruto looked satisfied, and immediately regretted it. If I knew you wanted to eat hot pot, I would have rejected you just now. A reward wasted for nothing. What's wrong, Naruto, why don't you eat? Seeing Naruto staring at him in a daze, third generation made a sound in doubt. Is it too ugly to eat yourself? Oh, eat, eat, eat. Naruto quickly collected his mood, picked up his chopsticks and started eating. Although the reward has been missed, it is a little regrettable, but the hot pot is still worth eating. More than half an hour later, the side dishes that had originally filled the table had all bottomed out. Both of them leaned on the chair contentedly, stroking their stomachs. Great food today, however, it is the third generation that wipes out most of the ingredients. Although Naruto can eat, but after all the body is placed here, no amount of stomach can hold it. Instead, it is the third generation. At such an age, my appetite has not decreased at all. Ahem, I'm too busy today, and I didn't eat much at noon, so I just ate more. Feeling Naruto's gaze, third generation couldn't help but blush. I didn't expect to indulge myself in just a hot pot, and I forgot the business here. I was so focused on eating that I neglected to deepen my relationship with Naruto. By the way, speaking of it, I forgot the reason for coming to you. As he spoke, third generation took out an envelope from his pocket and handed it to Naruto. This is, this is the living expenses for next month, 2000 tails. 2000 tails, wasn't it 1000 tails before? You've grown up too, and you've eaten a lot. 1000 tails probably won't be enough. You're growing up now, so you should eat better. Thinking of Naruto's conflict with the villagers in order to eat today, third generation felt that the living expenses would not be increased. Although nothing major happened today, the villagers of Konoha are not easy to mess with. Although there is his Hokage, they can't eliminate their resentment towards Naruto and Nine Tails. He was afraid that if Naruto had a bigger conflict with the villagers in the future, causing Naruto to start hating them, then all the plans that third generation had made before would be in vain. He wants to impress Naruto with the will of fire. Instead of making him hate others, especially Nine Tails Chakra is full of evil and can easily lead Naruto astray. Therefore, in order to eliminate this possibility, it does not matter that third generation would rather spend a little more money. Anyway, it's just a few thousand tails. Naruto looked at the envelope in third generation's hand, subconsciously going to pick it up. Then he suddenly thought of the thing that he just missed the reward. Grandpa third generation, I don't want it. Quote question mark quote. 
third generation stretched out his hand and raised it in the air, with a puzzled look on his face. Also a little surprised. Isn't the cost of living already used up? Why not? Why not? Successful anti-routine. Get 100,000 tails. 100,000 tails. Good. Grandpa third generation. I have grown up. I want to be self-reliant. Naruto said solemnly. His words made third generation choke suddenly. You little brat is self-reliant and a ghost. What can you do with your little body? Also, the things I bought from Naruto today are almost 1,000 tails. This account is still Konoha's public account. I have to take money out to make up for it. No, you are too young, what can you do, take it, and wait until you grow up. Third generation put the envelope in front of Naruto involuntarily. I don't even intend to listen to his explanation. Okay then, I'll take it first. Quote question mark quote. Didn't you say no? Third generation stared at Naruto. Naruto also stared at each other with open eyes. I don't want it, but if you insist on giving it, then I will take it. Quote dot 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 quote. Pick it up. Third generation looked back speechlessly. This kid is a little skinny today. By the way, there is one more for you. Third generation took out a booklet from its pocket again and handed it to Naruto. What? Naruto took it suspiciously. Today, third generation is here to give gifts. You are also five years old, and you can learn chakra. This is the chakra refining technique. Practice it early, and it will be more convenient for you to enter the ninja school in the future. Third generation said with a smile. Chakra refining technique. Be a ninja. Yeah, don't you want to be a Hokage? You can't be a ninja, but you can't be a Hokage. Third generation looked at Naruto and smiled in relief. Through his own contact and teaching with Naruto, Naruto has cultivated a good ambition to be a Hokage since he was a child. The will of fire has penetrated deep into Naruto's heart. And the self who made these achievements cannot be said to be indispensable. If you look at Danzo again, you will know how to pull people into the root, and then apply the sealing technique to forcibly control them. He also said that his method was not good. HMPH, when Naruto is a little older, he'll know he's wrong, and I'm the one who's right. After all, I'm Hokage. I don't want to be a ninja anymore. Just when third generation was triumphant and seemed to see Danzo's regretful old face, Naruto's words brought him back to reality. What? You're not a ninja anymore. The third generation was stunned, and looked at Naruto in disbelief. Didn't you still clamor to become a Hokage before? How did people change in just one month? Did something happen that I don't know about? But I read the mission report about Naruto every day. Could it be that someone is lying? Successful anti-routine. Get the five elements escape technique, escape technique. Metal, wood, water, fire, earth. Golden escape. When in distress, touch a metal object, and immediately escape to a place with a metal object within a radius of 300 miles, once a day. Wood style. When in danger, by touching the trees, you can escape immediately to a place with trees within a radius of 300 miles, once a day. Living trees must be touched. Water style. Jumping into the water, you can escape to any watery place within a radius of 300 miles in an instant, once a day. Fire style. If you touch the fire, you can escape, and you can escape from any fireplace within a radius of 300 miles, once a day. Caution. Flame burns when entering and exiting fire. Earth style. If you touch the soil, you can escape, and you can escape from any place with soil within a radius of 300 miles, once a day. I'm going. Isn't this the castrated version of Flying Thunder God? Although the shortcomings are a bit big, it has miraculous effects. Naruto was very happy in his heart. Although the number of times this five elements escape technique can be used as required, and the location where it may appear is a bit random, it has to be said that it is still very useful for escaping. Yes, Grandpa third generation, I don't want to be a ninja anymore. Being a ninja is too tiring. Every time I see those ninjas who are in a hurry, they don't sleep for missions. 007 every day, and their lives may even be in danger. I am anxious for them. Compared to a ninja, I want to be a simple shop owner, start a small business and make some money, so that I don't have to starve or suffer from cold. It's best to open a small restaurant, cook, stir-fry, and chat with customers every day, confined to day and night, kitchen and love. Quote dot 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 quote. 
third generation looked at Naruto who was talking more and more outrageous, and everyone was numb. No, after two days of starvation, is the aftereffect so serious? Why are people so stupid? Still limited by day and night, kitchen and love, you little kid, can you cook? Who do you want to love? At this time, third generation, I regret it. I deeply regret it. If I knew it earlier, I would not save money. The anti-routine is successful, and chakra has been increased by a hundred times. The moment the reminder sounded, Naruto's body shook, and the weak chakra doubled a hundred times in an instant, filling his whole body. Originally, Naruto has a vortex physique, and chakra should be far superior to ordinary people. But because when he was just born, in order to seal the nine tails, Namikaze Minato and Uzumaki Kashina jointly made an eight-sign seal, resulting in Naruto's chakra basically not much. Later, with the study in the ninja school, the loosening of the eight-sign seal, and the impact of the chakra of the nine tails, it slowly began to grow. Especially under the continuous use of multiple shadow clone techniques, he got a lot of exercise, and also made the vortex physique come into play. And Naruto, who was only five years old at this time, after getting the chakra 100-fold increase, the amount of chakra directly reached the level where Naruto graduated six years later. It's no problem summoning thousands of clones with these using multiple shadow clones. Moreover, the effect of a hundred-fold increase has not disappeared, so with practice and time, Naruto will only become more powerful. Hope to catch up with the amount of chakra of Tailed Beast. You really, don't want to be a ninja. Third generation looked at Naruto solemnly. At this moment, he realized that there seemed to be some unknown error in his plan. Improper. The anti-routine is successful, and one of the five attribute B-level ninjutsu is obtained. Ha, huh, how come all the chakra five attribute rewards are obtained from third generation? Is it because he is a ninjutsu doctor? Naruto, I know you may have suffered a bit due to living expenses these days, but isn't being a Hokage your biggest dream? How can you give up so easily now? And, I promised your parents to take good care of you. Third generation looked melancholy, not daring to express the anger in his heart after the plan was broken. I have to enlighten Naruto carefully, and figure out why Naruto thinks so suddenly. My parents, Grandpa third generation, didn't you say I was an orphan? You know my parents. Naruto looked at the third generation in surprise. He didn't expect that third generation would take the initiative to mention Namikaze Minato and Kashina. Also, what do you mean by, suffering some suffering? Do you know that the bitterness in your mouth would have killed your dear grandson long ago, okay? Really, standing and talking does not hurt my back. Yes, your parents are also ninjas, and they are also very powerful. They are the heroes of Konoha. So, as the son of a hero, how can you give up being a ninja? Did you forget that you have to be Hokage to prove to those villagers who hate you that you are not the so-called incarnation of the fox? Prove that you are not only the incarnation of the fox, but you can also protect them. Be a hero like your parents. How can you give up so easily? Third generation was also confused by Naruto's sudden move, and temporarily moved out of Naruto's parents to persuade him. Then who are my parents? Grandpa third generation, can you tell me? Naruto looked at third generation with big watery eyes and asked seriously. Quote dot dot dot, this is not the time yet, you will know later. I can't tell you this. You are still too young now, if you know that your parents are fourth Hokage, Konoha's heroes, you will probably spread the word. It doesn't matter if the identity of the hero's son is known. However, the identity of Nine Tails Jinchuriki cannot just be known so easily. If the other villages knew that the current Nine Tails Jinchuriki was only a five-year-old kid, then history could repeat itself when Cloud Shinobi sneaked into Konoha to try to take Kashina away. As third Hokage, he absolutely does not allow such a thing to happen. Especially, there is no Namikaze Minato who can bind Naruto through love now. Therefore, the third generation must not tell Naruto the truth. Third generation never thought that if he told Naruto, maybe Naruto would really show it off in the street for the reward. Although his safety may be affected, he believes that third generation will definitely do its best to protect him. Also, hasn't it been spread around Konoha that he is the incarnation of a demon fox? None of the other ninja villages believed in it. It's outrageous. Doesn't it mean that Cloud Shinobi are all brainless brats? What about people? 
Come up with your courage to test it. Unfortunately, third generation did not say. Naruto didn't have a good excuse to make him do this either. Can't you say? Then, I will be a ninja. Naruto turned his head, as if very angry. Quote exclamation mark exclamation mark quote. Third generation's expression cracked instantly. You are threatening me, successful anti-routine, get wind attribute chakra nature transformation grandmaster. Ha, there are rewards. No, Naruto, although your parents are heroes, but because they are too powerful, they also have a lot of enemies. In order to protect your safety, I can't tell you so easily. That's why you have to become stronger. Only when you become a powerful ninja can you face those dangerous enemies and have the strength to know the identity of your parents. Don't you want to know who your parents are? Third generation took out his tone and patience with his grandson, and explained to Naruto in a very gentle manner. Thanks to Naruto, who is only five years old now, he can still lie, no, he can still correct it. I think so. Then you have to be a ninja. I'm wrong. But if you're not a ninja, you can't know the identity of your parents. Grandpa third generation, just tell me not to. I can't tell you. But I want to know who my parents are. Then you. I do not want. Quote dot 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 quote. Third generation and Naruto stared wide-eyed. Third generation felt that his high blood pressure was about to commit a crime. The boiling blood rushed straight to the brain. Everyone is going to explode. Why is this little kid so difficult to deal with? Being self-willed, he was comparable to his own grandson. Ha! Huh. Third generation closed his eyes slightly, took a deep breath, calmed down his irritable emotions, and calmed down. How about this Naruto, although you may change your mind now, but you are still young, it is too early to decide your own future path, when you are six years old next year, go to school to study first, after you understand what a ninja is, then think about it. Facing the willfulness of children, third generation knows that only by following their wishes first, not forcibly negating or rejecting them, first giving some benefits, and then slowly guiding them after a few days, can get twice the result with half the effort. After all, children are easy to coax, and their memory is not very good. Third generation is very experienced in this. I'm not going to ninja school. I'm going to learn how to do business. Successful anti-routine, get the thunder attribute chakra nature transformation grandmaster. Hiss. Third generation took a sharp breath, closed his eyes, and forcibly suppressed his anger. Okay, it's getting late today, so I'll go back first, you have a good rest, and I'll come see you again in a few days. After third generation finished speaking, regardless of Naruto's reaction, he immediately got up and walked towards the door. He was worried that if he had a few more words with Naruto, everyone in Konoha would have to go to the hero tomb to see him tomorrow. I'm so angry. Goodbye, Grandpa Third Generation. Naruto waved his hand at third generation's back, which scared third generation to quicken his pace. Boom, the door was slammed shut. I didn't expect to get so many rewards, third generation is really a treasure. Sarutobi Hirazan walked towards the Hokage building aggressively with extremely low air pressure. The few Hokages who followed him were directly subordinate to Anbu, and they sensed that something was wrong with the atmosphere, and they felt extremely uneasy. Something's going to happen. Master Hokage is angry. Did Jinchuriki get into trouble again? Several people have guessed in their hearts, not knowing why. Fortunately, whatever happened had nothing to do with them. After all, their job is to keep Hokage safe. Although the third generation may not need protection. Come on, Master Hokage. Go and call all class 9. Yes, Anbu was about to leave. Wait, besides those who are working, those who are resting are also called. Yes, Anbu left quickly. Class 9th is a team specially established by third generation to monitor and protect Naruto. Their only task is to follow Naruto, monitor his every move, and solve problems for Naruto when something happens to him. It can be said that these Anbu are the most trusted Jonin of the third generation. But today's change in Naruto made third generation suspicious. After all, any news that the third generation got was passed on by them. Although he himself occasionally watched Naruto's movements through the crystal ball, but the information was too little to make an accurate judgment. Therefore, out of trust in them before, there was no doubt. But at this moment, he unexpectedly found that the weapon he had been holding in his hand had changed, 
which made him re-examine whether there was something wrong with these trusted subordinates. He still has two guesses in his heart. One is that someone may have contacted Naruto privately without his knowledge, and even Anbu who was watching. The second guess is that there is a traitor among his own people. Come here, bring over the information of all the members of the ninth class. Yes, third generation took out the report that recorded Naruto's daily life from under the table, and looked at it carefully. The change came today. Starting today, third generation will read the report carefully backwards. Has anything strange happened recently? Ha, huh, didn't go out three days ago. Why? Third generation saw in the report that Naruto hadn't come out since he returned home three days ago. I didn't run out until the living expenses were exhausted and the food I saved was exhausted. And, uncharacteristically, he became unscrupulous. He no longer resists communicating with the villagers who hate him, and he doesn't mind the other party's insults, even if the insults are very ugly. Furthermore, it seems that he is not surprised at all by Anbu's appearance. Although Anbu also appeared when Naruto was injured before, it was only that time. Why are you not surprised at all today? It seems, as if you know their existence. Someone was exposed, or, someone tipped off the news. Third generation looked at the report and found clues. But I still don't want to understand whether someone has come into contact with Naruto, or Naruto is too nervous and treats Anbu's appearance as a normal thing. It can't be said that Naruto is very talented, you guessed it yourself. Although Namikaze Minato is also very smart, but according to Naruto's previous performance, it doesn't look like he inherited his IQ at all. On the contrary, he is more like Kashina, carefree, with a simple and honest personality. Boom. Enter. Master Hokage. All class 9 are here. Eight ninjas wearing Anbu masks came in and knelt on one knee, waiting for orders. There is one more person who did not arrive, that is Yi Chuan, who is looking at Naruto. There are a total of nine people in the ninth class. Three people operate in groups, and then three people take turns monitoring Naruto in time slots 24 hours a day, and the other two are on call at all times. One group shift per day. The staff is quite complete and the work is very easy. It can be said that Anbu is the most comfortable except for those who protect Hokage. After all, they don't need to fight and kill, they don't need to do various tasks, and the benefits are also very good. This is also the special care given to this group by third generation. Because of Naruto's young age, this job is easy, but Konoha places the highest emphasis on it. They are also one of the most trusted people of third generation. Third generation didn't speak, but took out the files of the nine of them and looked at them carefully. He wants to see who betrayed him. Well, this has been with me for five years. Three years, although the time is relatively short, but the last name is Serutobi. This is also Serutobi. These six years. This is also. Wait, have you ever worked at the root? Third generation frowned and put this document aside. Hum, and the roots. After reading several documents, third generation unexpectedly discovered that two of them had previous working experience. Although he should have known it long ago when he was choosing. Otherwise, it would be impossible to put them on Naruto's monitoring list. Moreover, these two people have not been sealed by Danzo, which means that they are not core ninjas at the root, and they don't know much about Danzo's secrets. In particular, they are from the Inoshika Cho clan. It is a Hokage lineage ninja. But today, he, who has just personally experienced the changes in Naruto, saw the word, root, again, and he couldn't help it. Who told him to know everything about Danzo, and Danzo also knew his depth. He had a big fight with Danzo about the ownership of Naruto. After so many years, I still can't forget Naruto, and I have to compete with him for ownership. Especially last time when Naruto was injured, Danzo was very excited. If he hadn't used his identity as Hokage to forcefully suppress him, who knows what he would do. But now it seems that Danzo really did something sneaky behind his back. Among the people in Anbu, there are people with roots, and third generation knows it well. Likewise, the roots also have his Serutobi people. The two of them turned a blind eye to the spies placed by each other, and they had a tacit understanding. But, at this moment, Danzo actually stretched out his hand to Naruto, then he couldn't bear it. I have taken care of the seedlings that have grown up with great difficulty. 
If Danzo makes them grow crookedly, all previous efforts will be in vain. Though he wouldn't kill Danzo. However, once the weapon of Nine Tails Jinchuriki is in the hands of Danzo, it means that his Hokage career will come to an end. Having lost the most important political chip, his future work is bound to be full of difficulties. He will never allow it. Where is Yamanaka Yichuan? Several Anbu were still wearing masks at this time, and third generation didn't bother to tell them apart, so they asked directly. Back to Lord Hokage. He's on duty now. Oh, is it him? Third generation lit his bong, took a deep breath, and spoke indifferently, without emotion. He remembered the phrase, Brother Anbu, he heard when he first arrived at the door of Naruto's house. Is it really Danzo? At this time, the few people below were still kneeling on one knee since they came in. Although they were puzzled in their hearts and felt that the atmosphere was not right, they still didn't dare to make a single move. Then when the third generation spoke, they were surprised to find that they were actually sweating. Yamanaka Yichuan, Akamaiki Dingya, from now on Shikai will remove Anbu's identity, follow-up arrangements and other notices. Yes, Lord Hokage, Root Base, Master Danzo, our two eyeliners in Anbu have been relieved of their duties. Yamanaka Yichuan and Akamaiki Dingya had just been dismissed by third generation, and here Danzo received the news. The transfer of information is not unpleasant. Which two are they? Danzo frowned. He was installed as Anbu's eyeliner, and he has been safe and sound, why was he dismissed so suddenly today? What happened to Hiruzen? It's Yamanaka Aigawa and Akamaiki Tingya from Nine Tails. The subordinate replied immediately. Them. Danzo was stunned. What happened to them? Isn't Nine Tails Jinchuriki good? Why did Hiruzen remove these two? What's wrong with Nine Tails Jinchuriki? Danzo asked solemnly. Although he did things in a dark and unscrupulous manner, his starting point was still for the good of Konoha. And Nine Tails is about Konoha's safety, so he is even more concerned about it. It's just that as time goes by, and his old partner Serutobi Hiruzen shines too much in Hokage's seat, he becomes more and more envious. Therefore, many unnecessary measures, even the means of endangering Konoha, were used by him in order to win the position of Hokage. He also never let down his vigilance against Nine Tails Jinchuriki's surveillance. In my heart, I hope that something will happen to him, and I don't want him to have an accident. Of course, if he can make use of the topic, he still prefers something to happen to Jinchuriki, so that he can force Serutobi Hiruzen to surrender custody of Jinchuriki and hold this powerful force in his hands. But unfortunately, Namikaze Minato's eight signed seal seems to be too powerful. After so many years, there is no leak at all. A true match for his mighty Hokage scramble. It's so troublesome to die. My lord, there is nothing wrong with Jin Chiriki. Then, what is Hiruzen doing? Danzo didn't quite understand what the purpose of Serutobi Hiruzen's move meant. He didn't cause him any trouble during this time, did he? He's busy with Uchiha too. Danzo, who knows Serutobi Hiruzen's character well, knows that his sudden move must not be aimless. There must be a reason for him to do this. Good boy. He actually made a move that he hadn't even guessed. There is progress. Danzo became angry. I am also afraid that my brother will have a hard time, and I am afraid that my brother will drive Luhu. That's the Danzo mentality. Originally, we were indifferent to each other, but you suddenly became enlightened. I cannot accept. Since the eyeliner has been pulled out, Let's transfer two people from the route to continue monitoring the Nine Tails Jinchuriki. Although I don't know the reason why Serutobi did this, but in order to prevent himself from being passive, he has to take the initiative. Moreover, Danzo speculates that Serutobi may have made some new arrangements for Jinchuriki, otherwise it would not be so sudden. But, where is Master Hokage? It doesn't matter, you just do it. Danzo stared, am I still afraid of him Serutobi Hiruzen? Even if he is Hokage, he can't interfere with his actions. But Hokage, snort, I'll get it sooner or later. Dot dot dot. The anti-routine is successful, and the four-image seal is obtained. Quote question mark quote. Lying on the bed, Naruto felt suspiciously all the knowledge about the four-image seal passed by the system. What's going on? Where did the reward come from? Could it be third generation? Naruto couldn't help sighing. As expected of Konoha's Hokage, the value is higher than ordinary people. You can earn so many rewards. Dot dot dot. 
The next morning, Naruto got up and went out to start a new day of wool gathering. The morning is getting colder and colder, and it is estimated that it will snow soon. Fortunately, I bought a lot of clothes and quilts for nothing yesterday. This winter should not be so sad. Naruto let out a mouthful of white mist and walked towards the breakfast shop. Come early, you again. When the boss saw Naruto coming earlier, he frowned subconsciously, and just wanted to drive him away, but immediately recalled what happened yesterday. Forget it, isn't it just a few buns? Get out early. Out of sight is pure. For you, he packed a few buns and threw them to Naruto with disgust on his face. Um, why don't you resist? It's so easy, I'm not used to it. Naruto blinked and looked at the boss curiously. I. Call, do you think I don't want to resist? I still want to beat you. But if I hit you and you touch porcelain again, and Anbu stands up to block me again, wouldn't I still have to give you buns? In this case, it would not be better for me to give you directly. Why bother? Then do you want it? If so, just take it and get out. By the way, a total of one or two, give me the money. After communicating with the victims yesterday, I found that I became the only boss who got taken advantage of. I learned a lot from a fall, and put away the money. I still need money, you want to eat for free. Then I don't want it. Naruto threw the buns on the stand, turned and ran away. You, the boss was dumbfounded. No, don't you want to go earlier? Why don't you ask for money? You didn't treat other people like this yesterday. What about Anbu's ninjas? Come out and pay the bill. Boom, the furious boss clenched his fist and slammed the table. Grass, the anti-routine is successful, and a drawer of goobly steamed buns is obtained. Quote question mark quote, who are you scolding? Oh, scold the boss, that's okay. Dot dot dot, tisk, I'm a little hungry, it's not okay to skip breakfast. Although he was rewarded, he got it at the cost of not going early. Being hungry is a real deal. I don't know if Ichiraku ramen is open, if it's this early, probably not. Naruto trotted all the way to the entrance of the ramen shop following the memory. However, at this point in time the business has not yet started. Then we can only make do with it. Naruto randomly found a noodle shop selling breakfast that he hadn't been to yesterday. After a series of procedures, Naruto sat inside as he wished, and ate with satisfaction. But this time, Naruto was not given a chance to show his acting skills. When the boss just wanted to do something, Anbu showed up directly. With Anbu's support, the boss can't sell it if he doesn't want to, after all, Hokage has given orders before. If Anbu wasn't there, no one would say anything when he drove them away. Unfortunately, Anbu didn't know if he had received a new order to show up faster. Then Naruto ate and drank enough, took a toothpick in his mouth, and started the daily life of a street skater. Went there yesterday, will go again today. Not for anything else, just to see the, surprised, expressions on their faces. Those who haven't been there must definitely go once, so that they can get to know themselves again. Even if you don't buy anything, you have to go shopping. Hokage Building Sarutobi Hirazan ignored the documents on the table and carefully watched Naruto's every move in the crystal ball. Poker face. It's just that the white smoke lingering in the entire office represents his inner melancholy. He looked at Naruto as if he was having fun, teasing those bosses in various ways. Puzzled. Is this what you call wanting to quit being a ninja and want to open a restaurant? You are simply making trouble for no reason. This style is even more arrogant than his little grandson. Who is the prince? Oh, Naruto is Hokage's son, Konohamaru is Hokage's grandson, it's not wrong that he is the prince. Boom, Hiruzen, give me an explanation. The door of the office was pushed open suddenly, and Shimura Danzo walked in with a cane and an angry face. Seeing this, the wrinkles on third generation's face seemed to deepen. What's the matter? So big. Who messed with you again? Third generation skillfully put away the crystal ball, watching Danzo entering the door, he was slightly speechless, could he knock on the door? What about your own office? At the same time, he was well aware of his intentions. Also felt deeply helpless, did my own Hokage fail too much? Although Danzo is his good friend since he was a child and wears the same pair of pants with him, he doesn't take his Hokage seriously at all. In particular, 
After the death of 4th Hokage Namikaze Minato a few years ago, the attitude became even more aggressive. It's simply bullying. Ha, huh, wait, why is this feeling so familiar? It seems to be very similar to what Naruto has done these two days. Third generation suddenly understood why he felt so headache about Naruto's behavior. It turns out that there is a precedent. You remove the two Anbu who watch Jinchuriki. Yeah, what's the problem? As a Hokage, I withdraw two Anbu, isn't it normal? So, these two people really belong to you, right? Are the root ninjas so devoted to you? Even if he has not been sealed and left the roots, he is still loyal. For this, even he Serutobi Hirazan has to admire Danzo. Speaking of these two, Danzo, you're going too far. I'm going too far. Danzo's only remaining eye glared. Who is going too far? Although I installed eyeliner, it was only to monitor Jinchuriki, and I didn't do anything else. Where is too much? But you, without further ado, attacked my people for no reason, who is going too far, do you have no idea? Give me an explanation. You shouldn't do something that doesn't belong to you. Just forget it this time. I don't want to see it a second time. In order to take care of his old friends, he didn't immediately execute the two ninjas who dared to deceive him, which was enough to save face. HMPH, your stuff. Danzo sneered. Nine tails is Konoha's property, he is not your private property, let alone your grandson. Hiruzen, don't go too far. We made an agreement at the beginning. Naruto's custody is with me. No one can interfere. Serutobi Hiruzen was also angry. Do you know how much effort he has put in to raise the Jinchuriki with the will of fire? What a pressure. When the result was about to succeed, I was almost destroyed by you. He hasn't confronted Danzo yet, but he beat him up. You really belong to me. Did I meddle? I just watched him in case something went wrong. Danzo roared not to be outdone. Whether you interfered or not, you know in your heart. In short, take care of your people. Hiruzen, you will regret it. I am Hokage. Snort. Danzo flicked his sleeves and left angrily. At the same time, I cursed Serutobi Hiruzen in my heart, the older I get, the smaller my mind is. It was obviously his fault, but he scolded himself in turn. Why, seeing that I am used to taking the blame, your own problems should also be blamed on me. It just doesn't make sense. Dot dot dot. Master Hokage, a root ninja was spotted watching the target this morning. An Anbu appeared and reported. Don't worry about him, just pay attention. If the opponent makes a move without authorization, it is allowed to cut first and then play. In order for Naruto not to grow crooked, he has to be stronger. The face has already been given, if Danzo still doesn't give up, it means he doesn't know how to flatter him. Yes, Master Hokage, dot dot dot, the anti-routine is successful, and you can get the seal of cursing the tongue and eradicating disasters. Ha, huh, Danzo's curse mark. What did he do with me? Could it be that my changes caught his attention? No way, is this old silver coin so powerful? Naruto felt a little nervous. He didn't expect that the third generation hadn't made any moves yet, and Shimura Danzo, who was hiding in the darkness of Konoha, was the first to notice him. What should I do? Do you want to end it? Go home first. Naruto frowned. He knew that his act of plucking wool was a bit counterintuitive in the eyes of everyone, and it was a bit inconsistent with his previous personality. But the previous self was also a troublemaker, so it was fine to cause damage everywhere. It is impossible to say that he went shopping and prostituted something for nothing, so he would attack him, right? I can't go back. If I go back at this time, it will be the biggest problem. You can be abnormal once, but you must not be abnormal many times. On the contrary, not only can't I stop, but I have to continue, so that they can accept and get used to it. Naruto walked aimlessly on the street, enjoying the gift of attention brought by his identity as a demon fox. The general villagers have not noticed the changes in Naruto, but the bosses who have been victimized look at him with complicated faces whenever Naruto passes by the door of their shop. There is disgust, disgust, anger, and helplessness. And these victims are the result of Naruto's wandering on the street all morning. Ah, I'm hungry. At this point, Ichiraku Ramen should be open. Naruto is still obsessed with Ichiraku Ramen. He hasn't tasted this famous delicacy since he came here. He trotted all the way, ignoring the hateful eyes around him, and headed straight for the target. Uncle, 
a bowl of tonkatsu ramen. I want a big bowl. Naruto rushed in, yelled loudly, and climbed onto the high stool, looking expectant. Okay, wait, the uncle responded with a smile. And after Naruto sat down, he noticed that the ninja next to him looked familiar. The white hair, mask, and the book, Massiveness to Heaven, in his hand all proved the identity of this person. What's the situation, how did you meet Hitaki Kakashi today? He remembered that he should not meet these, acquaintances, including Hitaki Kakashi before the graduation exam. It wasn't just Naruto who was surprised. Even Hitaki Kakashi himself was equally surprised. The teacher's child, he hasn't seen Naruto since he was born though. But the iconic blonde hair, as well as the beard on the face, are consistent with the identity of the Nine Tails Jinchuriki Vortex Naruto in the intelligence. This is not a book for you children to read. Kakashi switched the book to his right hand, avoiding Naruto's sight. Uncle, don't look at unhealthy things. You see that your hair is white. You don't have kidney deficiency, do you? Naruto said seriously. Ahem, you brat, what nonsense are you talking about? My hair is natural, it has nothing to do with kidney deficiency. Kakashi didn't expect to meet his teacher's child like this for the first time. Also, what is your name uncle? Am I not old? Call brother. Successful anti-routine, get a thunder fruit. Could it be another treasure? A thunder fruit was easily opened from Kakashi, which Naruto did not expect. The blame is that this fruit is too powerful. It is hard not to be excited. Therefore, in Naruto's eyes, Kakashi's value at this time is no less than that of third Hokage Serutobi Hiruzen. And he found out too. The more the characters in the plot, the more roles they play and the more important they are to the main storyline, the more rewards they will get. Otherwise, why are the things obtained from those bosses generally very common, very simple, and of low value, while in third generation and Kakashi, you can get items of extremely high value, even items that do not belong to this world. As a result, he looks forward to the acquaintances and friends he will be able to meet in the future. Quote dot 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 quote. Kakashi stared at his dead fish eyes and looked at Naruto who seemed to have light in his eyes suspiciously. I don't know why the sudden Harry. Uncle, are you in poor health? Do you want to see a doctor? Quote dot dot dot. I am in good health. Kakashi rolled his eyes and turned away. I don't want to talk to Naruto anymore. Why is what this kid said so annoying? Not at all like a teacher. Uncle Hans, do you have oysters or other seafood here? Seeing Kakashi's expression of not wanting to talk, Naruto turned his head and chatted with Shuda. Oysters, I don't have any here. We only make ramen. Why are you asking this? Want to eat seafood? The hand-slapping uncle is the whole Konoha, the only person who exudes kindness and no purpose to Naruto during his childhood. Even though Naruto is hated by others despite his identity as a demon fox, he still greets him with a smile on his face. Even when Naruto has no money to eat, he will find an excuse to give him a free bowl of ramen. This also made Naruto sincerely grateful, and remembered it for a lifetime. No, but I seem to have heard people say that eating oysters is said to nourish the kidneys of men. Naruto's words made the ears of a certain white-haired man who was reading a book twitch slightly. It also gave birth to curiosity. Really, oysters still have this effect. It's true, it's absolutely possible. If you don't believe me, you can try it. I'd better forget it, I don't have a wife. Shaking his head with a smile. However, I began to think about how to combine oysters and ramen to create a new recipe. He believes that if oysters are really as useful as Naruto said, then his business will not be far behind. It's just that this ad is not very easy to advertise. After all, everyone has to lose face. Uncle, do you want to give it a try? You look like you haven't woken up and are not in good spirits. It can really nourish your body. Naruto tugged on Kakashi's clothes and whispered. I don't have kidney deficiency. And I'm tired of doing tasks. Kakashi turned his head and yelled at Naruto. Don't think that no one will hear you if you whisper it. My reputation in public, be careful I will sue you for defamation. Successful anti-routine, get a copy of White Fang Knife Technique. Ha, huh, good stuff but Naruto cares more about why he gets the reward than the reward he gets. Could it be that Kakashi said no, but actually wanted it in his heart? So the trick was successful. Oh, I understand. Naruto seemed to have seen through the truth, 
folded his hands on his chest, narrowed his eyes, showing an expression of, everyone is a man, I understand. Quote dot 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 quote. The brat, it's so annoying. Boom, Kakashi was so angry that he used the body replacement technique and disappeared in place. He was afraid that if he stayed any longer, his only reputation would be ruined by him. Ha, huh, gone, Naruto stared at the smoke in front of him, dumbfounded. Slap uncle, what did this uncle order just now? Oh, I ordered a miso char shao noodle, and it was all ready, but I left as soon as I said it. The ninja is so capricious. In this case, I will try to solve it for him. Do you want to eat? That's good, so I don't waste it. He nodded with his hand and asked his daughter to bring out the noodles. Uncle, did you know that one just now? I know you, Hitaki Kakashi, the famous copy ninja, is also our Konoha hero. The trouble is, remember to write down the account. When he comes next time, you can ask him for money again. Naruto said while breaking apart the chopsticks. That's for sure. Ah, what I mean is, my tonkatsu ramen is also charged to his account. What? You are confused, what are you doing? It seems like you are meeting for the first time and you don't even know each other's names yet. Wouldn't it be nice to let a stranger who said a few words pay for himself? Don't worry, uncle, I told him such a good recipe for invigorating the kidneys. In the final analysis, he still made money, didn't he? Naruto blinked at his hands. The hand beat also blinked. It makes sense, but after all, you are still at a loss. Small meaning, small meaning. Dot dot dot. On the roof. Ah, Kakashi grabbed his hair with both hands, looking pained. It has been said that I have no kidney deficiency, why do you not believe it? And you, a middle-aged man in his teens, are talking about such an esoteric topic with a kid, is it really okay? Aren't you afraid of spoiling the kids? And I didn't even eat the noodles, you still have to count the money. Forget about the money, but I have to pay for the brat's face. You don't do business like this. Dot dot dot. Successful anti-routine, get ninjutsu, hard beheading technique. Ha, huh, why are there more? Is Kakashi eavesdropping? Ninja is really convenient. The anti-routine is successful, and the fire attribute chakra nature transformation grandmaster is obtained. Where did this come from? This reward. Naruto seems to have seen it somewhere. Oh, I remembered. It's the third generation. Because of this chakra attribute nature transformation, Naruto had brushed Fung and Lei in third generation before, so he recognized them at a glance. This old silver coin must be spying on me with the crystal ball again. Naruto was full of displeasure. Forget about Anbu's monitoring, and use a crystal ball. Sure enough, third generation didn't take his changes lightly, and he had to be more careful. As Naruto guessed, Hokage building, in the office. The third generation was frowning in thought. Oysters can nourish the body. Does this thing still have this effect? It's a pity, if only I knew earlier. At this time, third generation was full of regrets. But this does not prevent him from planning to try the effect. After all, it wasn't the first time he used a crystal ball to watch a female ninja change clothes. And this little secret was carried forward by his good apprentice Jiraiya. It can only be said that he is worthy of being a master and apprentice. Although Kakashi and Naruto met unexpectedly today, fortunately Kakashi knew the importance of the matter and did not greet Naruto and behaved very indifferently. Worthy of being my right-hand man. Third generation is very satisfied with Kakashi's attitude. Chapter 11. At night, at Naruto's home. Naruto took out thunder fruit from the system backpack. I didn't expect to eat the devil fruit in the pirate world when I came to the ninja world. Fortunately one of the most powerful logia fruits. If it is another department, then you have to think about it a little bit. You, it's really unpalatable. After Naruto took a bite, he immediately rinsed his mouth with milk. As for the rest, he stopped eating. Anyway, you can gain abilities by eating one bite, there is no need to eat all of them. A few seconds later, a throb came from Naruto's heart. After closing his eyes and feeling it for a while, Naruto also understood the usage of this fruit. He raised a finger to activate the fruit ability, and the white electric glow was like sparks, sizzling and jumping continuously at the fingertips. I don't know if this has the side effect of seawater, just going to take a bath, try it. A few minutes later, 
Naruto lay comfortably in the bathtub and did not notice any weakness in himself. It seems that the side effects have been removed by the system. Naruto is very satisfied with this. The comfortable bath made Naruto drowsy unconsciously. When he opened his eyes again, he found that his eyes were pitch black. The lamp is broken. Hiss, it's a little cold. Naruto looked at his body, still wearing daytime clothes, and there was no fruit. He turned around and looked around, and didn't know where he was until he saw the tall, unfathomable huge prison door. Sealed space, is the chakra that I grew and the chakra of nine tails linked together. Naruto stepped on the water and walked towards the seal. It was as dark as ink inside, and I couldn't see my fingers. It's as if the nine tails that were supposed to be inside disappeared. But Naruto knows, it's still there. Should be sleeping right now. Call me in, are you still asleep? Naruto reached out and patted the pole. Get up, get up, the sun is drying the fox's ass. Kurama, call, accompanied by the two huge lanterns glowing red, a gust of wind blew over from the depths of the seal, blowing Naruto's young body back again and again. Little ghost, are you looking for death? How dare you disturb my rest? Finally, with the sound, a huge fox revealed half of its body, and its mouth was open, showing sharp teeth, staring fiercely at Naruto's fox head. Let's not talk about whether you are looking for death or not, you better tell me that this is not your tone. Otherwise I will feel a little disgusted. Naruto held his nose and waved to nine tails. Kurama. Successful anti-routine, yet primary conqueror's hockey. To be honest, seeing Naruto's performance at the moment, Kurama was a little confused. As the most powerful one among the tailed beasts, just showing his aura is enough to make most people or animals feel fear and bow their heads. But this kid, under the impact of his aura, was not frightened. It's not nine tails. In the past few years, according to its observation of Naruto in the seal, he is not the kind of bold and desperate person. Mental endurance is pretty good. Living in loneliness and darkness, not only did he not complain or hate, but in order to get rid of loneliness and change others' perceptions of him, he became more optimistic and learned to persevere. At least in terms of causing trouble and making trouble, I have always been very persistent. But, that's because he hasn't met this uncle before. My uncle is a collection of hatred and the source of chaos. As long as the kid in front of me has used his own chakra and knows how powerful he is, he will use it for me. Be my puppet. Hello, you are the nine tails sealed in my body, it's the first time we meet, please give me your advice. Naruto took a few steps forward, looking bravely at Kurama through the railing. Do you know where this is? Of course, otherwise, why would everyone call me a demon fox? Although they really didn't know that the tailed beast that made trouble in Konoha and destroyed half of Konoha was in my body. Don't you hate them? Kurama didn't expect Naruto to know something about it. No, Naruto shook his head. He said that he had only been here for a few days, and he hadn't reached the point where he hated them. And after two days of my own operations, a small number of people have seen that they are not so disgusted. Because they have learned to ignore themselves. Therefore, the predecessor's method of using trouble to attract others' attention will not work. Only the, intimate, contact with others can make them change their minds. Kurama, how do you not hate them? If you don't hate them, how can I persuade you to take revenge? If you don't take revenge, how can I persuade you to use my power? Kurama never expected that the day he met Naruto, he would be chatted to death by Naruto. Successful anti-routine, get ninja. Pass your own chakra only for perfect Jinchuriki. It seems that Kurama's heart is very disturbed. Naruto thought secretly. At the same time, Kurama sees that Naruto doesn't seem to have any hatred, and the method doesn't work, so it decides to come hard. Show Naruto your power. Although its chakra can only leak a little bit because of the seal, it is still very strong for this kid in front of him. Boom, accompanied by a gust of wind. Traces of red energy began to go towards Naruto's body. Come on, feel my power. You're going to like him. Use this power to do what you want. Even if it's revenge. Roar, Kurama yelled at Naruto. The violent breath blew and shook the talisman paper pasted on the seal. I may have something I want to do, but it's definitely not what you said. Maybe I will take revenge on those villagers who hate me because of the current situation to take revenge on 3rd Hokage Serutobi Hirazan. 
but I will use my own strength. Just like I will impress you with my sincerity, mutual understanding and mutual trust. Naruto felt the violent force in his body, looked at the maddened Kurama, and said to it calmly. There is only hatred between people. Calculations. Trust. Ridiculous thing. Little devil, you are too naive. Listening to Naruto's words, Kurama became more and more angry. I love you. Quote question mark quote. The violent momentum suddenly stagnated. It's as if time has stopped. But then, it resumed again. Naruto's young body was blown back and forth, unable to stand upright. Don't you not believe it? Time will prove that I am sincere. Kurama. Suddenly, the space shook. Naruto sat up suddenly from the bathtub, gasping for breath. Good guy, you won't wait until you don't come out of the space, you will be drowned, right? Also, was he shaken out? The anti-routine is successful, and illusion, phantom dreamland is obtained. Phantom dream. The illusion of manipulating emotions, from fear to sadness, from sadness to joy, even creates a dream with beautiful scenery and warmth, which can make the person who is deep in the dream indulge in a scene of warm sunshine and flying grass, making him feel unparalleled happiness and peace. However, it takes time for this illusion to activate, and it is not as convenient as Sharingan, and it can be done with a glance. One month later, the cold winter came, and Konoha also ushered in the first heavy snow. After a night of snow, the snow on the ground has reached the calf. Naruto was a southerner in his previous life, and he had never encountered such a heavy snow, so he was very happy. After getting up, he ran out the door. For more than a month, Naruto has basically visited all the shops in the main streets of Konoha, which made many people get to know him again. This led to the complete end of Naruto's fleece operation. It's not that I don't want to continue, but that I really can't move. Those bosses were completely drained by Naruto's daily visits. No matter how Naruto picks, teases, or turns around, he can't shake the cold hearts of these people. They said, watching you make, watch you make, watch you dance and cry, I will stand still, as stable as Mount Tai. Now Naruto's conversations when he goes to the store are like this. You're here, take whatever you want. It doesn't matter if you don't pay, I will ask Lord Hokage for reimbursement. This left Naruto speechless. The value of these people is too low. As a result, Naruto could only shift his target and focus on other villagers passing by. First, I got a set of porcelain, and the effect was not bad. Then, like an idiot, follow other people, making them very annoying. Or take the initiative to play with those little children. You may not believe it, but Naruto's operation made the children on Konoha Street disappear without a trace. I'm afraid Naruto will harm them. In the past, when the villagers of Konoha saw Naruto, they scolded him face to face, drove him away, and despised him with their eyes as a matter of course. Now, anyone who sees him will immediately avoid him, step back a few meters, and never approach him. She was even afraid that he would come up to her. Although there was nothing wrong with him coming up, he was just irritated. They can scold, but cannot hit. Can't afford to provoke or hide. They hadn't thought that this brat could be so annoying. Simply enough, they even jointly went to Hokage, hoping to drive Naruto, the demon fox, out of the village. They are worried that if this continues, their lives will be greatly affected. No, the impact has already begun. Unfortunately, Master Hokage dismissed their opinions. And understand it with reason, talk deeply with the villagers with emotion, comfort them, and persuade them. Then third generation had to take time to wander in the leaves when he had nothing to do, walk here, look there, keep getting closer to the villagers, he was as tired as a dog. But although tired, but the harvest is still there. That is, his reputation as Serutobi Hirazan became more resounding in Konoha, and his status in the hearts of the villagers rose even more. From their point of view, being born in Konoha is absolutely extremely blissful. To be able to meet such an approachable Hokage-sama is simply something that other ninja villages can't even imagine. And when those caravans who came to Konoha to do business asked how their Hokage was, they were very proud to tell his glorious deeds of Serutobi Hirazan. Some of the spies who came to inquire about the news were confused. It can only be said that it is worthy of Hokage, as expected of Konoha. But the shadows in other villages don't think so. Rock Shinobi Onoki hypocrisy, cloud shinobi eye, weakness, 
San Shinobi Luo Sand, role model. As for Kurigakur, they said that they are busy, so please do not call. During the period, third generation found Naruto many times to exchange feelings and have dinner together. After his unremitting efforts, he finally convinced Naruto that he didn't want to be a ninja, and straightened this little sapling that was almost crooked. He was so happy that he couldn't tell. At the same time, he also lamented that it was fortunate that he discovered Danzo's plot early at that time, otherwise he would have no place to cry. Danzo. However, the actual situation is that Naruto can't get any wool from third generation. It should be said that this topic has no value at all. Therefore, he can only cater to third generation's ideas, lest the other party jump over the wall in a hurry and come to be tough. This also makes Naruto have a bold assumption, that is, how much reward can he get if he betrays the village? Or join the Xiao organization, what rewards can I get? But this is just a thought. After all, he was only five years old, and he was only six years old after the winter. And even though he gained strength far beyond ordinary people through rewards, he was still a bit unappreciative in front of Rinnegan and Obito. If he went by himself and then disappeared, wouldn't that be a free gift? Therefore, Naruto felt that he should exhaust all the value of Konoha before considering other things. Creek Creek. Naruto walked towards Ichiraku Ramen while wearing basketball shoes and stepping on the thick white snow, feeling the joy of winter. Speaking of which, when winter is here, a certain little lowly should run out one night and get lost, and then be bumped into by herself. Naruto said he couldn't give up this reward. Naruto went to the door of the store while thinking about it. Only. Why are there so many people? There are still people queuing up. Looking at the queue at the door, Naruto was puzzled. Could it be that the hand-slapping uncle is doing New Year's activities? But the time hasn't come yet, is it so early? Naruto didn't want to affect the uncle's business because of himself, stood in the distance, tiptoed to look, and then passed the crowd, and saw a signboard at the door. Fresh taste fresh, oyster special ramen. During the event, New and old customers will get a 10% discount. And there will be extra small gifts. Eat oyster ramen, he likes you too. One bowl is refreshing, two bowls will never get tired, and three bowls are good for my daughter-in-law. Strengthen your body and cure your weakness, you deserve it. Quote question mark question mark question mark quote. What is this? I didn't realize that hitting the uncle with his hands is still a talent. Is this okay too? Naruto was stunned looking at the billboard, he was so shocked that he couldn't speak. Naruto took a closer look at the people in line, boy, are they all men. Moreover, because of the winter, they either wore hats or scarves, covering most of their faces, for fear of being recognized. Deceive yourself. Naruto shook his head speechlessly, and then he saw a certain maverick, staying at the end of the line, occupying a large open space by himself. He was wearing a green tights and a green vest, and was punching slowly. Quote dot dot dot. Guy is here too. What did he think? Naruto avoided the people in the line and walked around the line. Uncle, are you here to eat noodles too? Ha, huh, oh, yes. Guy turned his head and saw no one. When he lowered his head, he saw a child looking up at him curiously. Uncle, are you here for the oyster ramen? Yes, according to the boss, eating this food can improve your health, so I'll try it too. E.H. Although it can strengthen your body, aren't you afraid of getting angry? As far as Naruto knows, Guy doesn't seem to have a wife, right? Is it okay to eat too much? Get angry. Kakashi is not afraid of me, why should I be afraid? Guy gave a thumbs up, laughed ate big white fang, and smiled at Naruto. Quote dot dot dot. Kakashi, is he eating this too? The corner of Naruto's mouth twitched, Mr. Kakashi, I didn't say that, don't blame me. The anti-routine was successful, and I got a sunwheel knife my wife Shani. Quote dot 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 quote. It's not my fault. The sunwheel sword is a sword made of gorilla scarlet iron that absorbs sunlight and it will change color according to the owner of the sword. The scabbard, hilt and jaw of Shani's sunwheel sword are all white and the blade is golden yellow with lightning blade patterns. Although Naruto doesn't know anything about the breath of thunder, but because of the thunder fruit, his control over lightning is even stronger than Cloud Shinobi. And the adaptability of this knife to lightning should not be bad, it just matches the White Fang knife technique obtained before. Although White Fang uses the short sword for his saber technique, 
Naruto does not pursue the mastery of the saber technique, but only seeks a surprise. Well, uncle, you are busy first, and I will leave first. Naruto, who was afraid of being beaten by Kakashi, hurriedly left this place of right and wrong. It doesn't matter whether Kakashi is eavesdropping or not, let's go first. Leave the rest to Guy. Dot dot dot. After lunch, Guy walked out of Ichiraku ramen full of food and drink. He did feel full, but he didn't have the feeling of strengthening his body and refreshing his mind. Isn't it working? Go to Kakashi and ask. Guy said and walked in a certain direction. It may be difficult for ordinary people to find Kakashi who is resting, but for Guy, as long as he is looking for him, he will be able to find it. It's as if he locked on Kakashi automatically. Guy calls this sympathy from the opponent. No, on a tree next to a training ground, he found Kakashi who was reading a book. Yo, Kakashi. Hey, what's the matter? Say it first, no duel. Kakashi has a headache when he sees Guy. This very hot-blooded guy always looks so energetic, which doesn't match his personality at all. But even so, these two people with very different personalities are lifelong best friends and best opponents. I didn't come to fight you. Oh, what's the matter? Now it was Kakashi's turn to be surprised. Master Hokage has a mission. No, I came to you to ask about ramen. Guy shook his head in denial. Hand pulled noodle. Kakashi frowned, what does he have to do with ramen? Yeah, Ichiraku Ramen has launched a new product called, called, what is it called? Guy suddenly stopped. Raw meat, beef, raw sheep, wool. Quote dot 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 quote. Kakashi looked at Guy with a speechless face, his memory was about the same as that of a tortoise. But the name, and the two keywords of ramen, made Kakashi think of something. Oysters, ah yes yes, that's it, it's Kakashi. Guy gives a thumbs up. So, what does this have to do with me? Of course it has something to do with you. The boss said that eating oyster ramen can strengthen the body and cure weakness. He even said Kakashi is good. Quote question mark quote. What are you saying? Kakashi vaguely felt something was wrong. According to Naruto, eating oysters can nourish the kidneys. No, no, that's not the point. The point is, why does the boss want to advertise with me? I haven't had time to eat it yet. When I went to the seafood market to buy oysters, the boss said they were out of stock, and I had to wait a few more days. Did they all get bought by hand? And I don't suffer from kidney deficiency. How many times have to say it? Call out. Kakashi's big face suddenly approached Guy, staring at him closely. What else did he say? Huh, there's nothing else. Guy scratched his head, wondering why Kakashi was so nervous. Is it gone? Phew, that's okay. Kakashi heaved a sigh of relief, but fortunately, he didn't talk nonsense with his hand. But why are you looking for me? Ah, by the way, I want to ask you, I also ate ramen just now, but why didn't I feel anything? Maybe it's too little. After all, it's just food, not medicine. It's not so easy to be effective. Besides, maybe it's a lie. Kakashi said indifferently. Oh, so you need to eat more. But a child said that if you eat too much of this thing, you will get angry. Are you angry? What? I don't know. Which kid? Wait, I didn't eat. Kakashi was stunned. Would he get angry easily if he ate too much of this stuff? It's a kid with blonde hair, about five or six years old. He asked me if I'm not afraid of getting angry. I said Kakashi is not afraid of eating. What am I afraid of? Ha ha ha. Guy raised his head with his hands on his back and laughed but he didn't notice that Kakashi's air pressure in front of him dropped rapidly, and his figure seemed to be dyed in pitch black. By the way, Kakashi. Dog thief. Die. Boom. Guy looked at Kakashi after laughing, and just when he was about to say something, he saw a fist magnified, hitting his eyes, and then flew out backwards. Call out. Guy, who fell out, did a few backflips to stabilize his figure. Instead of being angry at Kakashi's sudden shot, he looked excited want to have a passionate duel. Okay, I'm ready. 51 wins and 50 losses, a new record will be set today. Ada. Dog thief, tell you to talk nonsense. Still talking nonsense in front of that nasty brat. Kakashi was so angry, it was Naruto who said that he had a kidney deficiency, and no matter how he explained it, it was useless. Well now, Guy said in front of him that he ate raw oysters, isn't that self-inflicted? 
How can I meet people in the future? Kakashi is really, the more I think about it, the angrier I get. And Guy is more and more happy. That's it. Come on, push harder. Dot dot dot. Fortunately, Naruto didn't hear such stupid words from Guy, otherwise he might die laughing. Now I am not afraid that Guy will get angry. After all, what is there to be afraid of with Kakashi helping to relieve the fire? Right now Naruto is busy with other things, busy drawing maps. He drew the main roads of Konoha and the iconic signboards on the map, and the paintings are very vivid. Then wait until night and start squatting. For several nights in a row, Naruto wandered the streets, watching third generation bewildered. What is this kid doing? I don't sleep at night, are you looking for something? Or can't sleep? The anti-routine is successful, and the Earth Attribute Chakra Nature Transformation Grandmaster is obtained. Again, have you been peeped again? It's a pity, why didn't I get the ninjutsu reward of the telescope? In this case, I can also, he he he. Naruto was extremely looking forward to the day when the system would suddenly give him such a ninjutsu, so that he could try what it would be like to peek at others. Especially Serutobi Hiruzen. This man has a lot of secrets. Naruto was walking aimlessly while holding a few skewers of free-for-all skewers. Until he saw a young figure, stepping on the snow, walking alone on the street. Finally come. Do you know how long I squatted waiting for you? Said Naruto was squatting, as if he was going to do something bad. In fact, he just wanted to have a chance encounter with Hanada, and some rewards for whoring for nothing. Although he endured the severe cold and heavy snow for this reason, and stayed at home at night, it was as strange as a ghost. But Naruto said there is no other way. Otherwise, according to my personality, I might really stay behind closed doors and miss the chance meeting with Hanada. After all, he doesn't know which day Naruto and Hanada met in the original book. I didn't say the specific date, and this picture still appeared in the memory chapter. Speaking of the memory chapter, I was also deeply complained about by myself in the previous life, which is too bad. But luckily, what you pay for is rewarding. Then, after seeing Naruto find Hanada through the crystal ball, third generation immediately hid quietly, eating skewers while peeking at Hanada. This kid, shouldn't he take the initiative to approach people when he sees them? Why did he change his temper? Or do you think he is cute when he sees the children of Hayuga's family? Don't want to bully her. Ah. By the way, Naruto probably hasn't met anyone from the Hyuga clan yet, and he doesn't know how to roll his eyes, so this is, are you afraid? Third generation guessed what Naruto was thinking while smoking a cigarette. I also want to know what he is going to do. Then he and Naruto squatted on the side silently, and the other peeped through the crystal ball, watching Hanada wiping tears without blinking, and walking evasively. If Jiraiya sees this scene, maybe he will sigh from the bottom of his heart, confidant. It's just that it would be nice if the object is a more mature girl. Although Hanada is cute, she will never be punished. After several minutes, no, what the hell am I doing? After watching for a while, third generation suddenly realized that he was a Hokage, and was spying on the little princess of the Hyuga clan. What the hell was he doing? Fortunately, this is in my own home, no one found out, Otherwise, everyone would think that such a magnificent and upright Hokage-sama as Konoha is a pervert. He is also in a daze, messing around with Naruto. Just when he was about to put away the crystal ball and go to sleep, Hanada in the heavy snow suddenly stepped into a pit and fell down accidentally. Then he saw Naruto who was hiding aside as if he saw something he liked, and immediately got up happily and walked out. Quote question mark question mark question mark quote. This kid, do you like to watch the excitement so much? He Serutobi Hiruzen, who has lived for nearly 60 years, really does not understand the brain circuits of children. Dot dot dot, Hanada knelt on the ground, enduring the pain with an aggrieved expression on her face. At the same time, thinking about what happened when I ran out before, I felt even more uncomfortable, and cried again. Woo! As the eldest lady of the Hyuga clan and the future patriarch of the main family, she was scolded by her father because she didn't want to hurt Spark in the duel with her younger sister, and she was merciful and lost to her. She felt that she was too weak, trash, not worthy to be the heir of the clan. As a result, Hanada was extremely sad for a moment, and sneaked out, crying silently. And it was broken, especially, I seem to have lost my way. 
Although she is the eldest daughter of the Hyuga family, she has hardly come out alone in the past few years. Especially when she was a child, Cloud Shinobi tried to snatch her away. For this reason, Hyuga Hiyashi has been disciplined very strictly for the safety of her daughter. She wiped her tears and was about to stand up when she realized that a person was walking in front of her. Are you okay? A child about her size was looking at her with a smile. No, nothing. Are you hurt? Can you get up? Naruto stepped forward to help Hanada up and looked at it. Apart from the dirty clothes, there were no other traces. I'm fine, thank you. Hanada thanked in a low voice. Can you go home? Quote dot 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 quote. Hanada blushed when asked by Naruto, she was embarrassed to say that she was lost. It's a bit embarrassing, you won't get lost, will you? Naruto kept smiling and looked at Hanada. Yes, yes, yes. Hanada twisted her little hands together and nodded. I knew it, cough cough, no, I mean, luckily I met me. Naruto felt that he was too excited, so he coughed twice to calm down. Yeah, fortunately, I met someone, who was a child about my age. Hanada rejoiced in her heart, just when she thought Naruto might send her home, she saw him take out a piece of paper. Give, this is, Hanada took it suspiciously. This is the map, you are at this location now. According to the surrounding road signs, you can find your home. How about it, it's very convenient. You don't have to worry about getting lost when you come out in the future. Naruto pointed at the map and said to Hanada. Quote dot 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 quote. Hanada stared blankly at Naruto. It turns out that children always carry a map with them when they go out. Quote dot 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 quote. At the same time, there is also the third generation who is peeping silently. He smoked a cigarette silently, expressionless. Just now when he saw Naruto running out and helping Hanada up, he was already thinking about the advantages and disadvantages of Naruto's marriage with the Hyuga clan, but was interrupted by Naruto's hand. It's really mud that can't support the wall. Why didn't you inherit Minato's IQ at all? When Minato met Kashina when he entered school, he knew that he would open his mouth to help others. It's good for you. You don't tell jokes with others, but you want a little girl to go home by herself. How many strings does this brain need to be short to do this? Also, you are full of food, drawing Konoha's map, why, are you going to sell it? Sarutobi Hiruzen is really speechless, hating iron but not steel. Successful anti-routine, get a piece of sunflower acupuncture. The anti-routine is successful, and the water attribute chakra nature transformation grandmaster is obtained. One should be from Hanada, and one should be from third generation. But what the hell is Sarutobi Hiruzen doing? Why are you still peeking at yourself? Can't sleep at night when I'm old. Or miss my wife. Sarutobi Hiruzen. Do you still have the face to criticize me? How about you? Can you find your way home? Naruto asked concerned. Ah, I can find it. Hanada saw the building with the word, Hyuga, written on it on the map, and also found the way home. It can only be said that the map given by Naruto is very detailed, and the drawing is very three-dimensional, so that Hanada can fully understand it. That's good, it's getting late, go back early, lest you catch a cold. Naruto turned around as he waved his hand. Thanks. Hanada murmured thanks. Ah, yes, Naruto suddenly remembered something, took out a small ball from his pocket and handed it to Hanada. You eat this, what's this, you eat first and then talk. Hanada didn't suspect it, thinking it was candy or something, even Sarutobi Hiruzen thought so. But when Hanada put the ball into his mouth, before he swallowed it, he found that the thing melted in his mouth and disappeared. And then, Hanada felt a hot current flowing through his body. She was shocked to find that not only the bruise from the fall just now, but also the injury from the practice of gymnastics for the past few days was instantly healed. Pain and fatigue are all gone. So amazing. Thanks. Hanada still wanted to thank him, but found that Naruto had already walked several steps away. She froze in place then looked down at the map, turned around and walked towards home. It will be a long time in Japan, and there will be opportunities to meet again. Sarutobi Hiruzen silently put away the crystal ball and sat on the chair in a daze. Grass, looked lonely, Naruto saw that Hanada fell down, maybe injured, so he generously gave away a recovery pill, which gained a lot of goodwill. Time flies by and the new year is coming to an end soon. 
and, for others, New Year's is a time of family fun. But for Naruto who was alone, it was no different from usual. Facing the laughter and laughter all over the street, he only felt noisy. Therefore, I stayed at home for several days without going out, and concentrated on comprehending the few skills I had acquired. On New Year's Day, third generation had dinner with Naruto as usual and brought many gifts. Such as new clothes, food and so on. Since the experience of Naruto's temperament change after starving for two days, third generation is afraid of him. Doubled Naruto's living allowance, so that he no longer has to worry about having no money. Naruto also went to Ichiraku Ramen during the period. The handmade uncle specially took Naruto to share his research on the process of making oyster ramen. Then Naruto made several suggestions. For example, in addition to boiled oysters, they can also be grilled, adding different flavors to ramen and catering to different groups of people. The hand-beating uncle was very grateful, and said that this idea was proposed by Naruto, and he planned to give Naruto a commission of 12 tails for every bowl of ramen sold. A bowl of oyster special ramen costs 70 tails, and I give Naruto 12 tails. I can make some money by hand, and I can earn more. But Naruto said that money is meaningless to him and intends to refuse. But Nehi couldn't stand the persuasion by hand, so he had to accept it. In this way, Naruto suddenly has a good income. Until one day, the night before the start of the ninja school, an anbu appeared and handed an admission letter to Naruto. And it is said that if Naruto does not go, Master Hokage will take coercive measures and tie him to school. Can't tolerate Naruto's refusal. That's why he didn't send the notice in person. He was afraid of getting into a fight with Naruto, but there was nothing he could do, so he simply issued an ultimatum. Naruto sighed. Fortunately, this topic has been brushed up before. With the reward in hand, Naruto didn't resist. The next morning, Naruto stepped out the door. Go to the breakfast stand. Early. One or two. For you. The dialogue between the two is so simple and unpretentious. The boss's skillful actions make people feel distressed. When I saw Naruto, I packed the buns and put them on the table before he approached. Naruto didn't talk nonsense, put down the money, pick it up and leave. Oh, it's really lonely like snow. Naruto shook his head and sighed. These people are getting less and less fun. Dot dot dot. At 8 o'clock, at the gate of the ninja school. At this time, the place was full of parents who brought their children to report. While waiting for the school to open, tell your children, or have a cordial conversation with friends you know. Then when Naruto appeared, the lively atmosphere suddenly stagnated, and everyone's heart skipped a beat, watching Naruto frown with a complicated look on his face. Don't come over, don't come over. Why isn't the school open yet? Why is this kid here? Does he want to enroll? No way, no way. What about my child? Dot dot dot. Many people began to panic in their hearts. But when they saw Naruto appearing and didn't get close to him, instead they walked aside, they all heaved a sigh of relief. I'm afraid that he will come and cause trouble. Moreover, they can't leave at this time, otherwise they miss the entrance, how should they explain to Lord Hokage later? Could it be that he was scared away by the demon fox? They all feel extremely ashamed, let alone speak out on their own initiative. Fortunately, on such a special day, the annoying kid didn't mess around. Dot dot dot. The change in the surrounding atmosphere also attracted the attention of several people. That's Vortex Naruto. Shikamaru followed his gaze and saw Naruto who was yawning aside. Isn't this kid very annoying? Regarding Naruto's news, Ino doesn't even know how many times he has heard it in the past few months. And those words are all about how bad Naruto is, how disgusting. Not a good word at all. As if brainwashed, Ino instinctively frowned when he saw Naruto. It's okay, don't worry too much, just treat it normally. Yamanaka touched Ino's head and said with a smile. Not only that, Shikamaru, Ino, Choji, you may try to befriend him. You know the reason. Naraluju pointedly explained to them. Jinchuriki. Shikamaru thought to himself, regarding Naruto's true identity, it is not a secret among several great ninja clans. I see. Shikamaru nodded. It's a pity that he is not a handsome guy. Ino didn't care about this. After skipping Naruto's eyes, he began to look at other people, and then his eyes lit up when he saw someone. Choji followed Shikamaru anyway, 
didn't speak, and concentrated on eating. Dot dot dot. Jin Churiki. Uchiha Itachi looked at Naruto's figure and also frowned. Brother, what's the matter? Little Sasuke looked at Itachi curiously. Nothing. Itachi shook his head without explanation. Over there, Naruto noticed that someone was looking at him again. Although he was used to being looked at, he still couldn't help but look back. After all, the opening of the ninja school is equivalent to opening a new dungeon, and his rewards have been given. Then he happened to see Uchiha Itachi looking down and talking to Sasuke. Naruto's heart skipped a beat, and he walked over. His actions made many parents who had been distracted and vigilant against him stop for a moment to see which unlucky ghost he had found, and at the same time hope that Naruto was not coming towards him. Then they found that Naruto walked towards Uchiha's people, and immediately showed a look of fun on his face. You must know that in the entire Konoha, the villagers collectively hate, except for Naruto, only the Uchiha guards are left. Even the entire Uchiha clan is disliked. At this time, the only two people in the two villages who are disliked meet, what kind of sparks will be aroused, it is very curious. Even Yamanaka Haichi, Narishirju and other big ninjas couldn't help but stare at them. And Serutobi Hiruzen, who is in the office of the principal of the ninja school at the moment, has a dignified expression. Not to mention the roots that are everywhere, the heart that is like a pool of stagnant water can't help but fluctuate. The targets Danzo-sama pays close attention to are connected at this moment, just thinking about it makes me very excited. That is to say, Danzo did not come to the scene, nor did Serutobi Hiruzen's telescope technique, otherwise he had to rush to the scene to eat melons as soon as possible. Uchiha Itachi also noticed Naruto's movement. He watched Naruto approaching indifferently, without saying a word, just staring at Naruto. Then Naruto spoke. What are you looking at? Itachi. Serutobi Hiruzen. Yamanaka Hai. Nara Shirju. Other onlookers. I'll go. How brave. Although this brat is annoying, he is brave. He dared to say that in front of Uchiha. I'm really not afraid of death. Fight and fight. Dot dot dot. As soon as Naruto's words left his mouth, the surrounding crowd began to whisper. Naruto's ability to find trouble did not disappoint the people who eat melons. At the same time, they were still thinking, why didn't they meet sooner? If this brat is going to trouble Uchiha, just leave them alone. It can also let them watch more excitement, and by the way, know who is the better of the two of them. Not only the villagers were surprised, even Serutobi Hiruzen was dumbfounded. No, you really haven't heard of Uchiha's reputation in the village. How dare you? How dare you provoke such a group of psychopaths? Fortunately, today is Itachi, the Uchiha tribe who is deeply influenced by the will of fire and whom he is very optimistic about. Otherwise, I am really worried that something will happen. After all, the pride that the Uchiha clan often talks about is not a joke. Be careful, though, lest Uchiha's people have Jinchuriki's idea. The suspicious Serutobi Hiruzen quickly came up with a countermeasure in his mind while smoking a cigarette. In these years when he was Hokage, his Serutobi Hiruzen's strength did not increase much, but he played thieves in politics, especially when dealing with Danzo and Uchiha. He didn't need to think too much at all, and various means came out subconsciously. Without him, only hands are familiar. Dot dot dot. Successful anti-routine, obtained C-level ninjutsu, fire-style fengxiangwo technique. Uchiha Itachi looked at Naruto blankly, but couldn't help but feel puzzled. Why is the son of the fourth generation so rude? How did Master Hokage teach him? But yes, if Mr. Hokage teaches well, then Konoha will not pass on the title of Naruto, the troublemaker and little devil in the world. The whole thing looks like it's grown savagely without any discipline. Itachi is very worried, will Uzumaki Naruto really protect the village after growing up like this? Is his seal still strong? Is it really not affected by Nine Tails? If that day does come, he wouldn't mind using the Sharingan to control Nine Tails. Who are you? How do you talk? Seeing that someone dared to provoke the Uchiha clan, especially his dear brother, Sasuke immediately became dissatisfied and angrily reprimanded Naruto. Sasuke, there's no need to be angry, the school is open, let's go. Itachi doesn't intend to have the same knowledge as Naruto, he's just a child around him, and he knows that Naruto's character is like this, as long as he doesn't come here deliberately to make trouble. 
Itachi pulled Sasuke who was still angry and turned around. Itachi's retreat disappointed the crowd who were eating melons. The exciting scene they were looking forward to did not happen, which also made them lose interest in continuing to pay attention to them. Looking at the open school gate, they walked over with their children. Yamanaka and Nara looked at each other and nodded. Uchiha Itachi's understanding is unexpected and reasonable. It can only be said that he is worthy of the name of genius. They were going in too. Just then, Naruto spoke again. Are you cowardly? With his hands on his hips, Naruto shouted at Itachi's back with an extremely arrogant attitude. Anyway, in public, there is no need to worry about what someone will do to him. If someone wanted to attack him, Itachi would probably be the first to say no. Itachi is a person who cares about Konoha, and Naruto is concerned about Konoha's safety, even if he is upset with Naruto, he will not let Jinchuriki have an accident in front of him. As soon as Naruto's words came out, all the villagers who had turned their backs turned their heads again, their eyes lit up. There will be another time. Now I kind of admire this brat. It's so cool. I like it so much. Uchiha can't bear it now, can he? Fight and fight. Dot dot dot. Itachi paused, and a, well, appeared on his forehead. Who is cowardly? Who dares to say that I am cowardly? You didn't see me when I cut people down, otherwise you wouldn't have the courage to talk to me like that. Also, you little ghost, why are you pestering me? Don't you know my last name is Uchiha? If there were not too many people here, I would have to beat you up. I have to give you an illusion to let you experience what it means to be cowardly. Itachi, who has always been calm and calm, now became very irritable and irritable for some reason. Successful anti-routine, get Uchiha shuriken. Could it be that I've been hit by an illusion? Itachi was startled suddenly, and quickly concentrated on disrupting the flow of chakra, but nothing changed. Then he attributed his own ailment to the influence of Naruto's unique temperament. That is, anyone who comes into contact with Naruto will be affected by him and become easily angry. Successful anti-routine, obtained B-level ninjutsu, shadow clone technique. You fool, who is calling you cowardly? My brother won't. Woohoo. Itachi didn't look back, but when Sasuke, who always defended his brother, heard Naruto's words, he turned around immediately, glared at Naruto, and cursed, but before he finished speaking, Itachi covered his mouth and was dragged away quickly. Sure enough, even Sasuke was affected. It seems that the people in the village hate him for no reason. You, woo woo woo. Although Naruto received the reward, Seeing Itachi didn't respond at all, and when he wanted to continue to squeeze the wool, he was treated the same as Sasuke, and his mouth was covered. Why are you still talking? Don't die. Seeing the daring Naruto's reluctance, Luju didn't want to continue to cause misunderstandings, causing Uchiha and Jinchuriki to confront each other, so he immediately stepped forward and pulled Naruto to prevent him from saying something terrible again. That is to say, Itachi has a good personality and is sensible. If you change to Uchiha, do you think he will give it a try? You must beg for mercy. In particular, although Uchiha is not gregarious in the village, he is surprisingly united in the eyes of outsiders. Mess with one, and you'll attract a whole bunch. They don't care if you are a child or not, and if you make a mistake, they will take you to the prison of the security department for a while. What the hell? Naruto pushed away Lujo's hand in disgust, very dissatisfied. My own rewards haven't been collected yet. There are only a few B-level ninjutsu, and there must be better ones in the future. This is Uchiha Itachi. The value is very high. It might even surpass third generation. If he can get a pair of Mangekio for free, then he will. You kid, you are not happy to help you. Come to school, the door is open, go in quickly. Lu Ju looked at Naruto and smiled, turning a blind eye to his attitude. When fourth generation was still there, he and Namikaze Minato were good friends, and originally his child, Luju was supposed to take care of it. However, due to Jinchuriki's identity and the order of the third generation, they couldn't take the initiative to contact Naruto, which made him feel a little guilty. However, seeing that Naruto can grow up healthily, he was somewhat relieved. It's this character. It seems that he was misrepresented by the third generation. Principal's Office Sarutobi Hirazan was relieved when he saw that Shikaju made a move. Fortunately, he stopped Naruto in time. 
Otherwise, he was really worried that it would be difficult for him to win over Itachi, a genius who came from the Uchiha clan and was biased towards the village. It's finally over, it's time to meet the children. Sarutobi Hiruzen put away the crystal ball, straightened his clothes, and went out the door. Sarutobi Hiruzen saw that Naruto had already arrived at the gate of the ninja school, so he definitely didn't have to worry about him not going to school. But what he didn't expect was that Naruto's main character was rebellion, and he didn't play cards according to the routine. It's so naive, do you think I will go in obediently? Ah, seeing that the school was open, Naruto didn't continue to disturb other people, after all, it would be impolite to disturb. He turned around and left the gate without looking back. Successful anti-routine, yet flying thunder god technique. In an instant, all the knowledge about flying thunder god was loaded into Naruto's brain by the system, allowing him to immediately master the usage of this ninjutsu. With the help of the system, even if you don't have the talent to learn the ninjutsu of flying thunder god, you can still use it as a skill in the game, one click to learn and one click to use. Naruto walked on the street, found a relatively hidden corner, raised his hand to activate chakra, and left a mark of flying thunder god on the wall. He was worried that his behavior would be noticed by Anbu, he thought for a while, loosened his pants, and untied his hand. I'm sorry, I have no choice but to. Anyway, my reputation is like this, so it doesn't matter how close it is. Naruto comforted himself inwardly, while looking at the flying thunder god imprint he had just left. Like, Naruto looked at the mark, frowned, and realized that it was actually the mark of Namikaze Minato. This word doesn't quite match me. He left the place, silently thinking about the new imprint style in his mind, while changing the spell. The surveillance Anbu's mouth twitched, with a disgusted look on his face. This guy who destroys public health. He showed up and rubbed water style, rushed to the ground, and dodged away. As Naruto expected, he didn't notice anything wrong. The anti-routine is successful, and I have obtained a B-level ninjutsu, water-style explosive water shockwave. System, I suspect that you are implicating me. Naruto pouted speechlessly. Then when he passed by a certain store again and came out of it, there was a small fox head logo on the bottom of a shelf that was not easy to be found. Kurama, want to please me? Dream, is this old man so easy to please? Childish brat. Kurama was idle and continued to observe Naruto through the seal. When it saw the inexplicable fox head, it smiled disdainfully. However, what surprised him the most was that Naruto could actually flying thunder god. Kurama is not familiar with the word, love, that was engraved just now. After all, it has also stayed in Kashina's body for several years, and has an incomparable understanding of Namikaze Minato's ninjutsu. It's just that it feels strange that it hasn't seen Naruto learn the ninjutsu of Flying Thunder God. And the chakra that exploded inside Naruto. It made it extremely suspicious. With the mentality of exploring secrets, Kurama started to get serious. Of course, this is its only fun. Successful anti-routine, Kurama chakra use authority increased by 3%. Huh, how did Kurama pop up? The prompt that popped up suddenly made Naruto, who was planning to mark the entire Konoha with his own footsteps, stop. Is it because of the fox head? TCH, you arrogant big fox. Naruto smiled and continued to act. Snapped. Another fox head was pinned in a corner. The anti-routine is successful, and 1000 detonating symbols are obtained. Dot dot dot. On the other side, the ninja school. Sarutobi Hiruzen, who was speaking on the stage, once again swept across the freshmen sitting below the stage still haven't found the familiar figure. Where did Naruto go? Shouldn't you find a place to sleep? This kid, what a hassle. Sarutobi Hiruzen did not realize the seriousness of the problem at this time. Until he finished his speech, left the opening ceremony and returned to the office. Come on, Master Hokage, where's Naruto? Considering that the ninja school is next to the Hokage building, it is very safe, and there are future heirs of various ninjas in the school, and I also feel that Naruto has grown up, so there is no need to monitor his every move in the school all the time. So when Naruto is in school, Anbu can take a break, just continue watching after school. Err, Vortex Naruto, what's wrong? Talk, Sarutobi hears and stared, wondering if any information about Naruto should be reported as soon as possible. What does hesitant mean? 
Vortex Naruto opened the door at the school, and when the children entered, they turned and left. The ninja who reported was sweating. He also didn't expect that Naruto would not come in when he was already at the door. Simply poisonous. Quote dot 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 quote. Sarutobi Hirazen was taken aback. So when he put away the crystal ball, Naruto left. What on earth does he want to do? Sarutobi Hirazen is so angry. Why is it so difficult for me to persuade him to come to school to study? Could it be that he would be obedient if he really had to beg him himself? Naruto, you can try it. If he is not Hokage and busy with work, he really wants to teach Naruto himself. Didn't anyone say that Naruto's lawlessness is due to his own teaching? Of course, these are rumors from ninjas who know Naruto's true identity. Absolutely no disrespect to Hokage-sama. Didn't I say that if Naruto didn't come to school, he would have to come? My words don't work, do they? Sarutobi Hirazen just output to Anbu, venting his anger. But, here he is. Anbu spoke more and more quietly, and he didn't feel that he had made any mistake. You, boom, Sarutobi Hirazen didn't expect that Anbu, who was close to protect him, would dare to insult him, so he stood up and slapped the table violently in anger. How dare you talk back? It's the other way around, right? If it wasn't for the word Sarutobi in your name, I would have killed you today. Don't dare, Anbu, surname Sarutobi, replied loudly with his head bowed. What are you doing still standing there? Find someone. Tie me up and bring it in. If I haven't seen anyone later, you don't have to come back. Yes, Anbu, who didn't dare to stay for a long time, played the fastest body flicker technique in his life and disappeared in less than a second. Several other ninjas hiding in the dark wiped their sweat together. Fortunately, I just went out late by myself. Otherwise, the one who gets scolded is himself. There is no word, Sarutobi, in my name. And the ninja who went to find Naruto also cursed inwardly. With so many ninjutsu, how come the body flicker technique, the fastest escape, is the best practiced? Now you're looking for death. And there's Vortex Naruto. Isn't it good to go to school honestly? Really annoying. Dot dot dot. Successful anti-routine. Get phantom body flicker technique Uchiha Shisui need Sharingan to activate. Shisui's body flicker technique. Where did this reward come from? Do you still need a Sharingan to activate? Naruto scratched his head, puzzled. Phantom body flicker technique. Hand seal, use Sharingan to separate multiple phantoms, phantoms will attack the opponent together with the main body, and phantoms will not disappear after being attacked. That is to say, every phantom may be an entity. And relying on this technique, Shisui has also earned the title of, Shisui of instantaneous body, and is extremely feared by the people of Mist Shinobi. Got you. What? Naruto only heard one sentence, and before he had time to react, he was carried on his shoulders and disappeared in place. Naruto almost thought he was kidnapped. Go to school. Naruto, who is this person with such a violent temper? Like a gust of wind, the screen flickered, and Naruto had already arrived at the ninja school. Vomit. As soon as he got off the opponent's shoulder, there was a churning in his stomach. This is so uncomfortable, are you in such a hurry? Naruto patted his chest and let out a sigh of relief. Okay, I'll go first, don't do this next time, will I still run? Naruto waved his hand to go inside, but a rope fell in front of him, and then he was tied up. Quote question mark quote, Uncle, it doesn't have to be like this. Naruto looked up at Anbu who was wearing a mask helplessly. I'm here and you still tie me up. Is it so ritualistic? Master Hokage has an order to tie you in. Go. Follow me to see Hokage-sama. With previous mistakes, Anbu vowed that he would absolutely follow Master Hokage's order. If you say tie me up, I will tie you up. Walk. Anbu, who was getting more and more angry, pushed Naruto's shoulder and urged him to move forward. It's all this brat, who got scolded for nothing. Tisk. Naruto was speechless. Boom. Come in. Anbu pushed Naruto into the principal's office. Master Hokage. Bring Uzumaki Naruto. Sarutobi Hirazan nodded in satisfaction when he saw the rope on Naruto's body. Go down. Yes, Grandpa third generation, can you let me go? Naruto looked at Sarutobi Hirazan, very helpless. You still have the nerve to speak. Tied up first. At this time, Sarutobi Hirazan saw Naruto being tied up, 
his face was distressed and aggrieved, and for some reason, he felt a burst of joy in his heart. Give you some color, do you still want to open a dyeing workshop? Don't know whose territory this is. Now I finally realize my position. Xiao Mian, how dare you disobey my orders? Now Sarutobi Hiruzen suddenly realized. To deal with Naruto's lawless and mischievous character, this is how to deal with him. Let's see if he still listens. Have you forgotten what I said yesterday? Sarutobi Hiruzen took out the cigarette stick as he spoke, and looked at Naruto leisurely. Ah, Naruto blinked. Quote dot 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 quote. This little fool really forgot. School, oh, I remember, you said you want me to enroll today, right? So why don't you come? I'm here. Naruto's confident Kaido didn't seem to feel that he had done anything wrong. Quote dot 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 quote. So angry. You don't care about the behavior of running to the school gate, making trouble for others, and then turning around and leaving, called, I'm here. Are you blind or am I blind? I'm talking about going to school to study. Strolling around the school gate doesn't count. Sarutobi Hiruzen's chest rose and fell, and he suppressed a low growl. I'm coming in. Naruto didn't care about Sarutobi Hiruzen's anger, and directly turned back. His words made Sarutobi Hiruzen stagnate. Come in. When? Didn't Anbu say that you turned and left when you opened the door? Did I make a mistake? Or is Anbu mistaken? Sarutobi Hiruzen doubted himself. Right now, aren't I standing in front of you in the school right now? Grandpa third generation, are you old and have bad eyesight? I know an ingredient that can improve eyesight after eating. You can try. Roll. Frustrated, Sarutobi Hiruzen, who felt that he had been tricked, stood up suddenly, slammed the table with one hand, pointed at the door with the other, and roared angrily. No, don't be angry, it's bad for your health, especially when you're old, I know. Come here, throw him into the classroom. Put him in prison. You are not allowed to leave the school until after school. Naruto still wanted to speak, but an Anbu appeared and covered his mouth, mentioning that he left the office quickly. Woo, the anti-routine is successful, and the silence technique time 3 minutes is obtained. That's okay too. Seeing Naruto being taken away, Sarutobi Hiruzen lay down on the chair, panting and weak. What the hell, if you talk a few more words with this kid, you will lose several years of your life. This is too irritating. I haven't seen you for a few days, why are you even more of an asshole? Fortunately, I didn't deliver the notice in person last night, otherwise I would have to be angry again. He decided to send Anbu to send word later. If Naruto doesn't follow suit, it will be tied up just like just now. Don't be discouraged, just have fun. The Anbu hiding around wiped off their sweat again. Worthy of Nine Tails Jinchuriki. Hokage-sama is so angry, yet he hasn't punished him at all. My role model. It's a pity that I don't have a Nine Tails in my body. Otherwise, even Hokage has to support them. Dot dot dot. Classroom 301. Uruka is taking the roll call with the roll call book. Uchiha Sasuke. Arrive. Sasuke propped his chin with his hands, with a cold expression on his face. The little soccer annexed to her was Nympho, staring at Sasuke's profile obsessively. So hot. Nara Shikamaru. Here, Yamanaka Ino. Arrive. Ino looked at little Sakura viciously, and replied loudly. This nasty little Sakura, actually robbed my handsome guy. Akamichi Choji. Arrive. Kagami. Arrive. Nagano. I am here. Um, the last one, the Whirlpool Naruto. No one answered. Is Vortex Naruto there? Uruka raised his head and looked ahead. The students who had just finished roll call also looked left and right. Didn't you come? Or are you late? Uruka frowned. He was not there on the first day and hadn't asked for leave yet, which made Aruka subconsciously classify Uzumaki Naruto among the fool students. This is not a good phenomenon. Aruka sighed slightly. Okay, it's fine if you don't come, let's continue with the class, let's do it first. Squeak. The classroom door was suddenly pushed open. Aruka and a group of students turned their heads to look. I saw Anbu wearing a mask standing at the door. My lord, something. Before Uruka finished asking, he saw Anbu get out of the way and push a child in, who was still tied with a rope. Uruka, what's the situation? Anbu didn't speak, and left immediately. Hey, help me untie it. Don't you want your rope? I'm going to sue you. 
Naruto turned around, poked his head out of the door, and shouted to the outside. Anbu, surnamed Sarutobi, seemed to have some unlucky things chasing after him, constantly increasing his speed, and disappeared. The anti-routine is successful, and you get Thunderbolt Flash super speed. This classmate, or you? Uruka rubbed his face, recovered from the bewilderment, asked Naruto with a smile on his face. Ha, oh, my name is Uzumaki Naruto. Teacher, do me a favor and untie it for me. Naruto walked up to the podium while talking, and said to Uruka. Although he can easily break free from this kind of rope, but in the public, he'd better forget it, so as not to be exposed. Moreover, that Anbu just now was tied so tight. You are the whirlpool Naruto. Uruka's face was a little ugly. This kid looks like a thorn in the head. On the first day of class, Anbu personally tied him up and delivered him, which shows how difficult he is. And, Uzumaki Naruto, that demon fox. Uruka's mood became complicated, and he helped to untie the rope on Naruto's body. But because of his professional ethics, he didn't have an attack. He thought about it after class. That guy. When Sasuke first entered the classroom, Naruto recognized this nasty guy who had provoked his brother at the school gate. You wait. How dare he challenge his brother, the arrogant Uchiha clan. I will teach you a lesson sooner or later. Sasuke-kun. Do you know that person? The little Sakura next to him saw that Sasuke appeared from Naruto, and his expression became wrong, so he asked suspiciously. HMPH. I don't know. Although he said he didn't know each other, little Sakura could still feel the anger in his tone. Seeing this, she kept Naruto in her heart. Sasuke's enemies are my enemies. Dot dot dot. So his name is Naruto. I didn't expect it to be in the same class. Hanada looked at Naruto with a red face, feeling extremely lucky. Whether it's the map given last time or the magical, candy, Hanada has always kept it in mind. In particular, she has to look at the map every night before going to bed, so that she is already familiar with Konoha's main routes. No more fear of getting lost when going out. Dot dot dot. E.H. It's him, but why was he tied in? Could it be causing trouble again? Ino looked at Naruto curiously, thinking it was very interesting. First, he boldly provoked Uchiha, and dared to say that the other party was cowardly. This scene is rare in a hundred years. Now it is the first time in the history of ninja school to enter the classroom with a rope tied to his body. Who knows, from the looks of it, it's very troublesome. Shikamaru felt a little powerless, such a troublesome guy, do he really want to be friends with him? Will you be exhausted? Dot dot dot. As for the other kids. The faces vary. Some are afraid, some are disgusted, some are resisting. The expressions are full, but all negative. I am afraid that of all the people in the classroom at this time, only Hanada is special. Hurry up and find a seat to sit down. We are about to officially start class, and you have been delayed for a long time. Uruka looked at Naruto with a complicated expression. Stingheads, fools, demon foxes. It's a little troublesome. Okay, Naruto nodded, put his hands in his pockets, glanced at everyone, looking for a seat. When many people saw Naruto's gaze, they immediately avoided, not daring to look at each other, and they didn't want to sit with him. Naruto smiled, not caring. However, among these people, there is one person whose gaze seems to be very aggressive. Oh, it's the second pillar. Naruto ran over without flinching, and when passing by him, he shook his head and clicked his tongue twice, looking very disappointed. Quote exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark quote. Seeing this, Sasuke immediately thought of Naruto's arrogant, are you scared? Single quote. Especially his elder brother, Uchiha Itachi, has not responded yet, but instead pulled him away quickly. This made Sasuke feel that Naruto felt that they were really cowardly and did not dare to face his cowardly performance, otherwise he would not look down on him and be disappointed at this time. You, Sasuke's face turned red, and he stood up angrily, wanting to teach this abominable and shameless guy a lesson. If it weren't for my brother's generosity, he would have turned your dog's head off a long time ago, and dare to be so arrogant in front of their Uchiha. Uchiha Sasuke, this is a classroom, what are you going to do? Seeing that the situation was wrong, Uruka immediately stopped it. At the same time feel very tired. It's only the first day, the first class, don't make trouble for me. 
Call. Sasuke calmed down, glared at Naruto, turned and sat down. Calm. Calm. Don't damage your image because of this nasty guy. I am Uchiha, a genius not inferior to his brother. Sasuke kept comforting himself in his heart. At the same time, I swear that once I find the opportunity, I will definitely beat the other party to their knees and beg for mercy. Successful anti-routine, obtained C-level ninjutsu, fire-style great fireball technique. Hey, as expected of the second pillar, it will explode at one point. Naruto walked to the back of the classroom and sat down next to the three Ino Shikacho. Do you mind if I sit here? You sat down. Shikamaru said it didn't matter, and he didn't expect Naruto to choose to sit beside them. I'm Nara Shikamaru. This is Yamanaka Ino, Akamichi Choji. Shikamaru introduced. Vortex Naruto, nice to meet you. Quote dot 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 quote. Shikamaru twitched the corner of his mouth, this person is a little familiar, familiarity is the most troublesome. Okay, for the first class, let's introduce ourselves first, let's get to know each other. Let's start with the first one in the first row at the door. My name is Kubomura, I am six years old, I like. While introducing himself, Naruto suddenly pretended to take out a bag of snacks from the inside pocket of his clothes. Hiss. The sound of tearing open the snack bag caught the attention of the three people next to him, especially Choji, who sniffed sharply. It smells so good. Are these potato chips? Why are they different from the ones I bought? Choji was drooling, looking at Naruto expectantly. Shikamaru and Ino looked at him strangely, they were just potato chips, what's the difference? Oh, and the packaging is different. Well, mine is barbecue flavored, do you want to try it? Naruto's snacks are one of the harvests he has obtained for nothing in the past few months. In addition to snacks, there are also different delicacies, and there are still a lot of them in stock. Barbecue. Speaking of barbecue, Choji's eyes suddenly shone brightly. Potato chips are Choji's favorite snack, followed by yakiniku from Konoha Yakiniku. And now, there are actually two kinds of delicious food combined. Choji couldn't contain his joy. Can I eat it? Although excited and impatient, Choji was still polite and reserved. Of course, this is for you. Naruto handed Choji the uneaten potato chips. But. Dot you haven't eaten yet. Dot how about this, I'll trade it with you. Choji, with rare generosity, handed Naruto his potato chips. No need, I still have more, do you want to? I also have cucumber flavor, lime flavor, chicken wing flavor, tomato flavor. Naruto took out several more bags and put them in the desk drawer. Still in class, Naruto didn't put it on the table blatantly. I want lime flavor. This is the first time Ino has seen potato chips with so many different flavors, completely different from what Choji usually eats. I'll have some chicken wings. Shikamaru was also polite and picked a bag. Immediately, the four of them sat in a row and ate snacks together. As for whether you are still in class, I'm sorry. Those children from the great ninja clan already know the basics, so it's okay if you don't listen. But where did you get these? Shikamaru didn't see Naruto's backpack either. Moreover, can he hold so many things in his clothes? Have you ever heard that a prime minister can punctuate a boat in his stomach? What? What is a prime minister? Shikamaru was stunned, what the hell is this? Also, are you pulling these snacks out of your belly? It means that my stomach can hold a boat, just a few bags of snacks, what a joke. Naruto smiled contemptuously. Really, then you must be good at eating. Choji said enviously. Quote dot dot dot, I believe in your evil. Shikamaru said that this would also deceive Choji, he would never believe it. Oh, didn't I fool you? What a pity. Quote dot 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 quote. This guy is really annoying. But Shikamaru didn't ask any more, he guessed that Naruto might have some kind of sealing technique. Successful anti-routine, get a detailed explanation of Go knowledge. Then, my name is Kagami, Kacha Kacha, 5 years old this year. Kacha Kacha, I like to eat, 3, color dumplings. Kacha Kacha, Kagami clenched her fists, her face flushed. Which fool is interrupting my speech? Uruka also frowned, who dares to eat snacks in his class? Then he listened to the sound, swept his eyes, and immediately locked on to the few people in the last row. Then he saw the Vortex Naruto. You again, Vortex Naruto, what are you doing? 
Uruka has blue veins on his forehead. Although I know you are a thorn, it will be more difficult to deal with. But how did you manage to assimilate and destroy the people around you in just a few minutes? Are you toxic? He seems to remember that the one next to Naruto seems to be a child of the Inoshika Cho three major ninja clans, can this also be affected? I'm listening to class, teacher. Naruto blinked, innocent looking like he didn't know what happened. Are you listening to the class? You are eating snacks. It seriously affects the discipline in the class. Uruka said loudly. I didn't eat it. Quote dot 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 quote. Shikamaru, Ino, Choji, all turned to look at Naruto. How did you manage to talk nonsense with your eyes open? Look at the corner of your mouth. How dare you say you haven't eaten? Uruka was extremely speechless. They were all caught, but they still refused to admit it. Ah, this, it should be left over from breakfast in the morning. After all, the school is too early, and I don't even have time to eat. Naruto wiped his mouth Kaido. Quote exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark quote. Shikamaru, Ino, and Choji's eyes widened instantly, their faces full of disbelief. Talent ah this is, you and I, Uruka was struck speechless by Naruto's sophistry. You, get out of the classroom. Uruka pointed angrily at the door. Fine, Naruto smacked his mouth got up and walked over. I'm talking about going out and standing outside the door. Don't leave, until the end of get out of class. In order to prevent Naruto from misinterpreting his words as leaving school, he deliberately added a sentence. Don't worry, I can't leave school now, and I won't go anywhere else. 4. Oh, Grandpa third generation said that if I leave school, I will be tied back. Naruto sighed, shutting Uruka who was about to ask why. As expected of Mr. Hokage, you really have the foresight. Naruto walked to the door and stood there silently, very helpless. Successful anti-routine, get five free coupons for hot springs. Okay, let's move on to class. Uruka calmed down and continued talking to the students. Seeing this scene, Sasuke sneered disdainfully. HMPH, idiot. Dot dot dot, my name is Nikano. Kacha Kacha, six years old this year. Kacha Kacha, who is it again? The familiar click sounded again, making the sensitive Aruka irritable again. He looked to the back row. Just in time to see Choji's chewing mouth stop abruptly. Get out, Aruka pointed silently, expressing that he didn't want to talk, he was so tired. Oh, Choji was not as eloquent as Naruto, and he got up and walked out the door with the few bags of potato chips that Naruto had just left behind. Seeing that Aruka was so angry, the three of them planned not to eat it, but Choji couldn't help it. It's just that I didn't expect to eat a few slices secretly, but I was caught. Uruka's eyelids twitched, trying to pretend that he didn't see the bags of snacks. Continue. Wait, you two, won't you eat any more? Uruka looked at Shikamaru and Ino dangerously. The two shook their heads in unison, indicating that they would not. They're not Choji, and they can still live with the snacks. Continue. Dot dot dot, outside the classroom, why did you come out? Potato chips are too fragrant, I can't help it, here it is. Choji handed the chips to Naruto. Naruto took it silently. Choji was about to eat, but Naruto suddenly stopped him. Let's go there, we can't hear you there. Naruto dragged Choji to the corridor at the end of the classroom, and ate by the window. Choji learned from others, and he recognized Naruto as a friend in his heart. Dot dot dot, it was finally time for get out of class to end. After the bell rang, Uruka quickly left the classroom. As a result, just went out. Where are people? Gone. He thought Naruto and Choji left without permission, but turned around. Good guy, are you two having a picnic? I saw Naruto and Choji sitting opposite each other, and there was a plate with cut fruits on the ground in the middle, and the two of them were eating deliciously. Naruto heard the movement, looked up, and blinked at Uruka, signaling for some. Uruka's face darkened, and he turned to leave. No, I can't take it anymore. He's going to ask Lord Hokage for a transfer. If it doesn't work, you can change the class belt. When he saw Naruto, he resisted and could not accept Naruto because of his parents who died tragically under the claws of Nine Tails a few years ago. As a result, after a short contact, he felt that even without his parents, he still felt that his work pressure was too great. Whirlpool Naruto, this boy is simply poisonous. 
If Uchiha Itachi sees this scene, he will definitely agree with Aruka's thoughts in his heart. Whirlpool Naruto has a problem. Even his heart, which had been frozen for 10 years because he was used to too much life and death, would become boiling because of Naruto. I want to beat him up. Dare to say that he is cowardly. Naruto was the first. Dot dot dot. Naruto put away the empty fruit plate, got up and patted his buttocks and walked to the classroom. It was very lively inside at this time, but after Naruto came in, the noisy voice suddenly dropped several degrees, and no one dared to speak loudly. Sasuke looked at Naruto coldly, but didn't go up to talk to him. After all, although get out of class is over, but still in school, the chances are not very good. If it is off campus, Sasuke said, don't leave after school. But although Sasuke didn't go to Naruto, someone did. Hey, I tell you not to be too arrogant. Sasuke-kun is very powerful. If you provoke him, be careful to be beaten and cry. Little Sakura stopped in front of Naruto, swearing his home field. Quote dot 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 quote. Naruto looked at the little Sakura who suddenly blocked him with a speechless face. No, where did you get the courage to say this? You like Sasuke, what does that have to do with me? And what does it have to do with Sasuke? Did Sasuke agree? Not only did Sasuke not agree, he was shocked. What is this woman doing? Even if I can beat Naruto until he cries and begs for mercy on his knees, shouldn't I say such cruel words? Don't look at me like that, I like Sasuke-kun, not you. Seeing Naruto staring at her silently, little Sakura became self-righteous. Quote dot 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 quote. Naruto was shocked. No, who likes you? Also, why is this feeling so familiar and annoying? Let Naruto have a strong sense of sight. Don't worry, even if I like Ino, I won't like you. Naruto said coldly. He didn't like little Sakura at first, but now he hates it even more. There are so many girls in Konoha, isn't Ino good looking? Or is the Hanada not fragrant enough? Or is the rich woman not rich enough every day? No matter how bad it is, Tsunade is also possible. After all, female juniors hold gold bricks, and female juniors give Jongshan a gift in their thirties. Therefore, Naruto is stupid to be a dog-licking little Sakura like his predecessor. Ah, by the way, I'm waiting for Sasuke to come to me, don't worry, I'll beat him up and cry. Naruto smiled and walked towards his seat avoiding little Sakura. Successful anti-routine, personal charm plus 100. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.